Just two hours south of Calgary, downtown Lethbridge, Alberta. It is our first weekend, Saturday night at the Briar. Prime time drama at the Briar. And what a difference a year makes. In 2021, Alberta captured curling glory. Finally, yes. four yes. is the charm for Brendan Fotcher. Wow. Darren Molding was instrumental on that team, but oh, how things have changed. Team Bodger parted ways with Molding, a breakup less than cordial. Now he's joined Team New Brunswick. And in the province, he helped deliver a Briar Championship. There's one thing on his mind. Redemption. Always special when Team Canada is on the ice, especially when it's the home province. Brendan Botcher, Team Canada, taking on James Grattan, New Brunswick. That is draw three. Bit of a spicy one tonight at NMAX Center. Get you caught up in action from this afternoon as it was Northern Ontario Brad Jacobs 5 3 over the wildcard team. Gunlinson, three wildcard teams this year. Manitoba cruising 10 3 over British Columbia. Nice game from Mike McHugh in there. Nova Scotia, also winners. And Gushu, wildcard team number one. No rust from Beijing, 9-3 over Quebec. So you see two pools. On each side, you want to be three. If you're top three, you qualify to make the playoffs. And we have a great matchup tonight. It is New Brunswick and Team Canada. Come on inside the building. As always, glad you're watching our coverage here on TSN. Brian Mudra, Kathy Goche, Russ Howard. So, Brendan Botcher, really exciting in his home province. Maple Leaf on his back. I'm just curious, Kathy, any storylines at all? Anything <laughs> brewing for this game? What you got? Wow, this is going to be a match. But for James Grattan before the game, he talked about that what really struck him last year when the team finally won, Botcher's team finally won, was Darren saying how much he was looking forward to playing in his own city, in his own province. And when he was cut, James reached out to him. But he also said it's not just sentimentality. It's that he's a great player and he makes his team that much better. Yeah, Darren Molding, his family is from here. He spent a lot of time here, so it definitely is a home game for him. All right, Brendan Botcher, four straight finals for us. He finally won one. Can this actually just be another game for the skip? If they're thinking uh, correctly and, and uh, clearly, that yes, it really can. There's no reason why it can't. All these top teams have been through these different things. It's called a distraction. You identify it, talk about it, throw it away and park it, and just say to yourself, look, we've played one game so far, this is just game two, 93% as a team, more of the same. So Patrick Jansen, obviously he's the new look for Team Canada, he's throwing those third stones, we can't wait. It is molding, Grattan, New Brunswick taking on Team Canada, first rock, next. The Tim Hortons Briar is brought to you by Tim Hortons, the official coffee of Curling Canada. By Home Hardware, Here's how. By Scotty's Facial Tissue. Unleash the Scotties. And by New Holland. Proud supporter of Curling Canada. You know, it's, it's just going to be another game of curling, to be honest. I think everyone's hyping it up to be something that it probably won't be. I'm excited and happy for Darren that he found himself on a team. He seems pretty happy out there, too. So, you know, hopefully we can walk away with a W from that game, as we want from all the games we play here this week. It's easy to say hard to do, but we're going to go out there and treat it like any other game. There's going to be lots of hype with it, obviously, and there has been. Darren's really shared with us the, the intention of going out there and focusing on our team and doing whatever he can to be a great teammate for us and taking that kind of pressure off of us. We're excited. Welcome inside in Max Center and they were a team one year ago in the bubble in Calgary and now they go head to head as Darren Molding a part of Team New Brunswick. What an ovation though that he just got. As it's time to meet the teams, brought to you by Home Hardware. Here's how we start with Team Canada out of the Savile Community Sports Center in Edmonton. Your skip, Brendan Botcher. Your third, Patrick Jansen. Second, Brad Thiessen. And at lead, Karak Martin. And Team New Brunswick out of the Gage Golf and Curling Club in Oromocto. Your lead is Andy McCann. Second, Paul Dobson. At third, Darren Molding. And your skip, James Grant. 
The 15th Briar appearance for James Grattan. Brendan Botcher, you know the story. Four straight Briar finals. He finally cracked through in the bubble in Calgary last year. Now getting to wear that Team Canada colors on his back here in his home province. The rock colors, Grattan yellow, Botcher the red stones. It was Botcher winning the draw to the button, so they have Hammer. And to start things off on this Saturday night, the lead for Team New Brunswick is Andy McCann. And Kathy Goche, we had a chance before the game to chat with James Gratt, and we asked him pretty specifically, how much is your team rallying around Darren Molding for this game? And he says, the intensity is through the roof. We want to win this so bad for our new third, and obviously they want to get the win in general. But yes, this game does mean more. Well, they know that Darren was very hurt by what happened, and although... You know, we heard James already say in that clip that, you know, it's just supposed to be a game and, and that Darren's focusing on the team, but the team is very much trying to lift him up this game and carry him through. Paul. Lead stones for Team Canada, Karik Martin, and what a thrill Please. for him to join his father Please. on that Briar Tankard. What a feeling Please. for the young man. No kidding. Only 100% in his game last yep. night. Right to it. Throws a lot. Good throw, Carr. Nice. Both teams going to take the uh, cautious approach here. And sheet, sheet four. We were just on it ourselves, watching, and uh, yep. it was just spectacular. Get back, yes, Gushu clean. game. Kathy, I'll start with clean, you. Yes, Obviously, you played at such a high level. Three Scotties wins. What? Is Darren Molding feeling inside right now? Hi, boy, Andy. Oh, gosh. You know, everybody is a little bit different. And for Darren, he's probably done a lot of self-talk that the best that he can be is when he parks all that, that extra stuff that happened to him and just go out there and be the best player. You want to prove to the team that cut you that they made a mistake, that you had a lot to bring to the team, that you were integral in their wins. It's hard to park the emotion, but you just want to be the best you can be. We saw that. A couple of years ago the with the Kathy O cut by Jennifer Jones. They did not have a great record during the week, but Kathy O probably careered in that game because <laughs> she wanted to make a point. Russ, you're as competitive as anyone. What do you think is going through the young man's mind for this game in his basically home city for Darren Molding? Well, Darren's really emotional. And that's what I love about the guy. That's what everybody loved about him. And, and I know James... Uh, can't say enough about Darren, but um, that can hurt him in this game. There's no question about it. It's just, it's just so easy to try too hard. His draw the button was already uh, much uh, off target as it could possibly be, and I, I just worry that he might. You know, it, we we all done it. We try too hard. So, at the end of the day, it's, it is. Uh, Botcher said it's another game. Uh, both teams get eight rocks. The rings are in the same spot. Um, just treat it that way. We are yeah, as guilty you know. as anyone in the media for blowing things mm -hmm. up and, you know, present company <laughs> included. However, you know, we saw Cooey go up against Flash and it was just different in how yeah. it's handled. It is a business. Yes. Obviously, you're going to see new faces, especially after this Briar, Clean. because after the Olympic cycle basically gets blown up Clean. and we expect a lot of different good, teams. Good, but good. this felt good. different. Yeah, it really did. I think I think the press release, uh, you got a D minus for that, and I think that's what really incensed Darren. And then, of course, this day and age, that blows it out of proportion. All right, keys to the game, Russ, and let's start with your former teammate and Team New Brunswick and James Grattan. Well, molding a better team. Uh, Darren's going to help James. We already know that we saw that last night's game, but it takes four. And the other two, the front end for New Brunswick, uh, they're really good players. I know these guys, and uh, Andy, I used to coach them, but... The right, front right end for right turn, Canada curled 97%, so it, it's going to take an effort of four of them here. And reading Darren, they've only played one event together in a curling club. Now you're in arena ice at the Briar. James has to read his releases properly. And for the defending champ, his keys. Pat on the back, and what I mean by that is Brandon Botcher, he'll definitely be comfortable bringing Pat in at third. Will Pat be comfortable with Pat playing third? You're throwing him into the defending champion role. That's a big task, not easy to do. And find the forefoot. Any time I see Botcher lose, it's usually because he hasn't got his draw weight. Once in a while, not very often. 100% on draws last night. Keys to the game, brought to you by Purex Bathroom Tissue, an obvious choice for Western Canadians for over 95 years. What's it running? Full feet, same as practice. I think if you throw what you did in practice, you'd be fine. And there's a look at the hometown kid wearing those New Brunswick colors. 
He was so excited about coming back to Lethbridge and talking to the media. Said, said, yeah, I, I basically grew up in this building. Come I watched on. concerts here. I used to come here watching sporting events. I made ice in the area. He's got family that still lives in Lethbridge, so this is quite the thrill for Darren Molding. No kidding. I think that was part of this problem, uh, Brian, is you, once you win the Canadian Championship, you're automatically back into Briar, and he yeah. goes, wait a minute, it's in Lethbridge, and then it was taken away. So it's, it's uh, really nice that he gets another chance. Yeah, that was... And the new look for Team Clean. Canada, and I say that it's a new look for Clean. us and for fans, but Pat Jansen has been Clean. around this team for a number of years. Clean. I remember even talking to Brendan Botcher last year in the bubble, and Good. he nice. came a number of years ago to an event in Japan, got to know these mm. guys. Obviously, he's the Ontario import, and they loved him. And he's fit right in. He's a great teammate. He's a great player. And for him, I mean... Maybe tough too, right? You got to step in, and as you talked about, that pressure stepping in, Russ. That's that's the extra step. One when you're you're filling that spot for the Canadian champion, so there's really no win. If they Those win the normal. thing, he's only normal. as good as Darren was, kind of thing. And in this particular game, the eyes are on him because he's obviously replaced Darren. It's going to be interesting. Uh, probably the thirds will decide this thing tonight. Any, any. Good, Darren. Hey, good tosses, buddy. New Brunswick uh, played really, really well against Dunstone and won by or lost by about a quarter of an inch. And uh, if my brother Glenn had made his last one, uh, Botcher probably loses his game. So they're they're both kind of in the same position. Uh, better stats for Clean. Team Canada, but yep. they both Got could it. have won or lost the first one. Clean. It's close. It's good. It's good. We're good. Wait's good. We're good. Good shot, Pat. Beauty. Very good. See you, Brad. See you, buddy. And I think that those shots are really key for Pat this early in the game to settle mm -hmm. down the nerves. He's not being forced to make a really, really difficult shot. Brad Thiessen said before the game that they have played in four Briar finals, and those are all big games. Yeah, and he feels know. this game is every bit as big, and that's how they have approached heavier. it as a team. It's a big game, yeah, and you need to here. really elevate your play. The other, the other variable here when you're, everybody in this building is watching that game. Yeah, except for me. And it's not. I have the other three. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's why <laughs> you yeah, get we're the paying big bucks. Russ. Yeah. You're not getting paid, but Kathy's oh, just, getting paid, yeah, actually, okay. so. <laughs> but we've gone from cardboard cutouts to a whole bunch of eyeballs watching this one game, and that's hard on the athletes, too. Oh, but I think we'll take it, man. We live yep. those cutouts, too, Russ. It's, it is awesome to have. And why not a spicy matchup, right? Like, yeah. it's excellent. Well, it's great for the game. We've 100%. got fans in the seats. Yep. Something for us to talk about. And there you go. That's awesome. <laughs> Solid easy. Yeah. Oh. Clean. And what a career. Hard to believe he's 30. It feels like he's Clean. grown up in front of our eyes. And just what a complete Clean. player, Brendan Botcher. And you want to talk perseverance? How about losing? Three oh, straight that. finals and breaking through in the bubble. Good for him. Just, just, just if he didn't break through to be in three straight finals, well, obviously four and won the fourth nice one. Shot. But can you imagine four straight Briar finals? It's unbelievable. Nice throw. And he's 30. He's 30. Oh, right. He's got a right. lifetime yeah. of curling ahead of him if he chooses to. Vic and I covered uh, Brendan's team in the junior way back when he won that. And I remember turning to Vic and saying, this guy's playing a men's game. Like it was totally different strategy, strategy, way more offensive, thinking farther ahead. It was very impressive. Yeah, star at the University of Alberta mm -hmm. up mm -hmm. north, obviously in Edmonton. Clean, firm, whoa, oh. clean it, just clean. That's fine. James. Kathy, Control. do you think this is a nice end for both these teams, just to kind of feel the ice, pretty? Pretty easy end, all things considered. I do. I think that, you know, we talk about all the hype. Well, they're fully aware of that. And the best way to settle everything down is have a relatively simple wide open end. And then both teams are also smart enough to know that they're going to have to play some rocks and play and make some good shots to win. But a great way to start for both. So a chance for Botcher. Test this part of the ice as he throws the intern hit right through. Buckle in. Excited to be with you on this Saturday night at the Tim Hortons Briar in Lethbridge. Saturday night in Lethbridge, draw three at the Briar, and a blank early on the board between our feature matchup, Team Canada, Brendan Botcher, yep, yep, and James yep. Grattan out of New Brunswick. Oh, 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 oh. And Russ, I want to read you a quote from a conversation I had 
with Brendan Botcher during the bubble time in Calgary. And what he said was, and this is obviously before he won, he said, I would love to play a Briar in Alberta like and feel that intensity someday. The added stress, the pressure. Right around, he remembered right. his first game in a Briar was versus cool. Brad Gushu in St. John's. He called it his welcome to the show moment. Yeah. And you remember you that crowd. That. And how grateful is now Brendan Botcher, home province, Team Canada jacket, and fans in the building on a Saturday night. Nothing like it. We were lucky enough to, to win the Ottawa Briar, and we were out of Ontario, Glenn and I. And uh, like the, you can't you can't describe it. It's and it's it's if you start bad, you know, if you lose your first two, you're like, oh no, you know, you're running around with a paper bag in your head, hoping that nobody recognizes you. But if you get it going, uh, it, it, the crowd just lifts you, and and off the ice too. You run into the hotel, and people are cheering and saying good luck, and hope you win this one, and it it makes a big difference. Remember Gushu, the, the famous meeting back home in yes. St. John's? It wasn't a great start. Yeah. I don't know if I remember a louder, more exciting yeah. final. Good I mean, job. you've played no. forever and been in the game, no. but that building and that moment, how, how special was that? 100%. That was crazy. He felt good, Paul. Yeah, he was really still here nice. And right down to, you know, they brushed Brad's last one right to the bitter end and made it by about an inch and a half. This is Darren Drop and practice that really curled, so. Yeah. Yeah, you should be okay. That was a game I don't think Walker could feel his shoulder. Remember, he was injured, right, and Nichols had to jump up yeah. to the hog and help drag that in. Yeah. What do you think, Andy? I think we've got to go a bit. Why should be close? Paul Dobson, right over the 42-year-old, yeah, throwing second stones for the team yeah, from Lamacto. Paul skipped a lot uh, for quite a few years uh, with go, his brother, and really good player. They beat us to go to LeBron ah. one year, and he just just he's a great hitter. Quick, hard there. Go, 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 go. Keep going. Able to just What's track right? it by, and that is Shot Stone, top eight. Good sweep, D. So other games on the ice for you. It's UConn taking on PEI, and yeah, Buzz in the building because that other Alberta team in the house, Kevin Cooey, taking on Newfoundland and Labrador. Cooey squeaking out a win versus Saskatchewan in an extra hand yesterday. Glenn Howard. Back at the Briar as well. Great to see him healthy and talking with Glenn just before the game. Obviously, he, he wished for a different result in that game versus Dunstone, but nice to see him healthy and able to compete. If you don't know the story with Glenn, couldn't even play in the playdowns, mm -hmm. and son Scott took over, did a wonderful job, and here they are, another Briar appearance. Yeah. <coughs> Didn't do much uh, with that last run back. Oh, 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 way up there. Andy, Hard. Andy, go, go, Andy, go. Paul Dobson, one, two, nice double. Good toss, Paul. Attaboy. All right, Kathy Goche, let's get it started. Update time, Alberta, Newfoundland, Labrador. Well, between those red stones is where Nathan Young went on his final, removed a stone, was trying to roll underneath, but rolled a bit too far. So it is wide open and hit for two. There is a stone on the outside, might be in, but it looks to be out. Man, no, it's good, it's good. Here, John Morris, the call in the house. Might as well put a stick, might as well put a stick to it. So two for sure. Put a stick to it, eh? So we can tell you, that's yeah, time delayed. Yeah, they put a stick to it, and it was just two. So Cooey, a 2 nothing lead over Nathan Young at the Remax Center in St. John's. Sorry, Brendan. Yeah. I don't mind that. We know this path. We know the outturn. Okay. Just flashed everything there on that uh, short run back. Wrong way to miss it when you've got hammer. You wreck on the front, and you clean things up with the skipper. Now they're in a bit of trouble here, Botcher. I'd like it. Yeah. You gotta go. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. Line's Top good. Eight. Straight. Line's good. Have a look. Straight. Like we're okay. Wait's good. Top four. Wait only. Clean it. Gotta bend now. You're all there. Wait's close. Got a T, 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 T. Gotta bend if you have to. Whoa, it's whoa, it's whoa, T right whoa. now. Yeah, no, T plus. That was good. I thought he was really good. Yeah. You were with like him all practice though. Same as yesterday? Yeah. Yeah. 14, 
PEI a 3 0 advantage in the second. You saw the update with Alberta for the 2 0 lead. And a blank from Glenn Howard. So awaiting the first score over on Sheet C. And a reminder three wild card teams as that's Matt Dunstone. You have Jason Gunlickson and of course Brad Gushu, the three wild card teams this year. Yep. Just for lines. Just for lines. Tight to the guard here. Well, just like. Well, well. Okay, our line's fine to back this one. Play. Nice Second briar for Jansen, who was with John yeah. Epping in Regina in 2018, winning a bronze medal, finding the podium, and of course alternate with Botcher at the last two briars, including that gold medal in the bubble in Calgary. Okay. Not quite where they wanted that one. It's, uh, it eliminates the yellows at this point, but uh, I think Darren's going to be real close to locking one on there. It can be hard to remove it. Line. Wait, hard. Hard, line. hard line. Gotta go line. Hard line. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. Wait there. Stay with it. Oh, yep. Oh. It's there. Wait there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait's real, real good, James. Right to it. I think you're fine to it. Atta boy. There's your hometown support. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> That's what he wanted to hear, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> it's great. Line's good. Easy, easy, easy. I mean, Whoa, Kathy at, at the Scotties in Thunder Bay, I think at the end there was, what, 500 fans are so yeah. allowed, and I mean, it, what a difference. But they were pretty loud there, and to their credit as well. Well, they were, and they were very pro Krista McCarville for a very good reason. Hometown okay team. Okay Not bad. And clearly, Darren is having a lot of fun. <laughs> Shoot. Yeah, that one tracks a little different than the other one. Yeah, the building holds about 5,500 or so. No, I just think and Max Center here in Lethbridge and a great crowd on a Saturday night. Forcing them to the outer is not going to. Okay. I don't mind. We've either. seen it. This, I think you, either. this is a better angle. Yeah, sure. I know, and it blocks off the better yeah. stuff. You got it, buddy. I think that's it. If he didn't get out to James, so this this type of situation won't bother James Gratton at all. He's seen it all. He's played the best, and he's not afraid of anybody. And uh, really nice strategist too. Like they they, they talked about going with the out turn because it's obviously easier to get in there as the threading the needle here. But the well, angle's not as good because Botcher can run it in there, leave his own, take out the yellow. So coming down in the intern is a smart move. Good pause. Russ, he's been close. Two bronze medals. This is 15th appearance. Both bronze just up the road in Calgary. And I think one of them with a guy in the booth there That's right. in 2009. That's right yeah. Yeah, we had, a, we had some great years together. And uh, James is one of those guys that. The more pressure there is, the more fun he's having. You know, it's really, really I great team player. Yep, Skip Get Stones here in yep. two. Hard. 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 Keep going. Keep going. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's good. Choke off that good. red one. So that was why they went that way. There was a lot of a lot more good things could happen on the intern than the out turn. Yeah, so he didn't make it, but now you can't raise the red one. Way was top four. I like that. Pile of pressure here. Brendan doesn't make this. He probably gives up a steal. Okay. So Kathy, I'm curious. Our first draw when you have two draws in a single day. And tomorrow we go to three a day. Obviously, we started in this morning with the feature this afternoon, okay. rather on sheet D. So I'm curious to get you to keep an eye on the time and see if a lot of the draw weight is the same from earlier today. Sure will, and especially on the side that this game is going on, it is very full, and so you can expect some warmth when we'll see the impact. Line's good. Line's good. Any men? What do you think? Yep. Line's good. Yep. Go ahead. Whoa. Whoa. I don't mind it. Whoa. Yep. Close Line's good. Whoa. Line's really good. close. Line's good. You gotta go. First. Gotta go. Finish. Finish it. Gotta go. Finish it. Finish it. Keep it going. Hard. Hard. Right to it. Hard. 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 Oh, oh, oh. 
And look Beauty. at that. Draw Wade. Brendan Botcher right on the pin. Good job. Beauty. Nice job, Brendan. What would it cost to rent that front end out for a couple of shots? <laughs> it's not just the sheer physical strength. But Martin knew that was a fraction light all the way down. And then made it perfect. That's good. Oh, did you know? <laughs> yeah. You can rattle off something that's not big. Can you hammer this? He might be able yeah, to hammer can. it. Yeah, we don't want to f screw around too much. I'm just wondering, like, right now, he gets two with that, eh? Maybe. He just runs that, that's two, because this jams back here. Is that, why you, is that why you're thinking maybe yeah. split them? But then he just runs ours in, maybe. Red, yellow, 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 red, we have yellow, to come right to it. red stays, and red stays. Yeah, I, I don't see much you difference. You actually though, get yeah. two there, Botcher, so going to try to take yeah. that away, believe it or not. Uh, well, don't, we can't spend too much on this. Maybe we just throw a guard, long, keep it long, but then he's, he's running that. that for two. And if, if he plays it, he's moving eight rocks. Uh, we don't have much choice. Yeah. Kind of, he can get there for two right now, eh? What are you playing, Russ? Yeah. I think I just guard it and leave him that. If you're really worried about that, you could tow the guard and wreck on one of those, I don't, I don't move it over a little bit, and, and then it takes away both angles. Just, just, yeah, right, just like that. touch the top one. Yeah, we got to make sure we get make something hard for him. Okay. I don't mind. I don't mind rattling the top. Okay. Let's That's take the call. a little bit of yeah. ice. I was taking out here. Okay. Rattle something. You don't okay. want to move the top red one too far because then it gets easier. But if you could get that top yellow one just yeah, short of the rings, the move it a couple of inches, yeah, your thrown saying. rock will guard the draw for two. And by moving off. that yellow, those raises aren't lined up. Yeah. You like okay. this, Kathy? I do, and I also think that Darren knows better than anybody on this sheet what Brendan is likely to play. So he knows what he's going to play. You can sort of take it away, and you've got some options. I got a hair less. Yeah. Top. Yeah. Top eight. Hard. Hard. Go, yep. Hard. James Grattan, his final Hard. stone go. here in two. Go. Hard. Top four. Hard, all you got. All you got. McCann Hard. and Dobson, they have been go, go, pounding go, go, this go, stone. Go, 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 go. They were okay go, go. with a little rub. Good. Tap, tap. It's fine. Good. Is that mission accomplished? Good. I don't think so. I don't think so either. He didn't move it enough to change to the angles very much. So we could make me take his red out, but yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep. Probably got to throw it a little straight, hey? Yep. Couldn't you raise the, the one that was just thrown, right, Kath? Just tick the red? Is there any danger I, here? Yeah, right there. Yeah. That's the easier shot. Well, there's no danger. <clears throat> if you whip it, if you whip it real hard, this rock is going a little, right? Yeah. This should spin out though. As long as we play it like with firm. Yeah. Much easier than what they were trying good. to well, this figure out on the other side. Yeah. Just a little Just bit. Three quarters. And if the yellow, if this undercurl. Do you like good medium, almost I don't firm, in something in that range? I, I think you might need firm to get this to here. Okay, firm it is. I think we got to play it to curl an inch. What do you? Two, three quarters? Three quarters two thirds? Three, three quarters. quarters. I think we're we're trying to hit this one pretty thin. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Where do you like this, Brendan? Yeah. I like that. If he jams it perfectly and this yellow one that's coming in stays there, they still score one. Three so as you heard yeah. them say, I don't think we can hurt ourselves. So this is the best way to maybe get two. It's not easy because if he, if he hits his red one super thin, the back yellow won't, there won't be enough power to get the back yellow. Just a fraction high side. So a chance Whoa. to convert with Whoa. Hammer after a blank in the first. Whoa. Final Whoa. stone, Brendan Whoa. Botcher Whoa. here in two. Curl, 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 curl. Curl it up, bang it back. Whoa. And just the yeah. one. So a single. Good force from James Gratton as we have our first points on the board.
Welcome back to Lethbridge, third largest city in the province. About 100,000 people call Lethbridge home. And what a great spot to be our home for the next week. Championship weekend next weekend, of course. All these teams trying to get to Las Vegas, Nevada for the men's worlds later on this year. And one nothing. As Botcher had an opportunity, that run back to try score a pair picks up a single. So for the first time in this game, it is James Grattan, New Brunswick Yellowstones with Hammer. It was a lot of work for both teams to have a force at one. And Botchers just didn't come up that inch he was hoping for. No, no. Close. Clean. Whoa. 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 Whoa, Darren. Whoa. Good, Andy. Shot. Oh, boy. So Darren Molding obviously became a free agent when he was let go from Team Canada. And that man right there, James Gratton, was asked about how this all came to be. Well, I think I found out just like everybody else of uh, what happened with Darren and his old team with Botcher and that sort of thing. And I kind of felt uh, a little bit for Darren in the situation, this being his hometown. Uh, he uh, mentioned in some of the media uh, releases at the time that his sons live in the area. And uh, it meant a lot to him to be at this briar. So uh, I kind of reached out and said, listen, we can uh, maybe make this work for you if uh, you're interested. And uh, he said, let me get back to you. And so I kind of thought that that was it at the time and I heard back from him about a week later. And he goes, are you serious about it? And I'm like, ah, I'm serious about it. I'm, I have a team now, four guys, but uh, we can make it work. And uh, apart from after that, it was just, uh, let's go, let's do this. And uh, we've been excited to have him. Adding a, a guy like Darren with his uh, background and his uh, experience, it's been great for us. And the rest, as they say, is history, is okay. Darren Molding now wearing those New Brunswick colors. Well, Brian, you asked him before the game if this was a one-time one year thing and he was pretty clear that this is this is not necessarily a one year thing they've talked about longer term wait's good yep. oh. down a touch oh. darren was asked yep. by the media what are your expectations oh. and he took a look at the person that asked and said well to win this thing we got what it takes to win this entire thing that's awesome all right my bad spin that no. so he mentioned there's a lot of fans in the house all right good job Paul. well there's one in particular right there brady molding Awesome. <laughs> Cheering on dad. How cool is that? Yeah, young man. Yeah, that's, that's, that's what it's all about, isn't it? Halfway. Hey, Paul. And maybe someday they'll get to share the ice together right next door. You got Glenn and Scott. You got that's, to play with your son. That's right. It's pretty cool. That's nothing that's awesome. like it. Nothing like it. Clean. A little solid. Close, close, close. Clean. Boy, this is a tough shot here. You're, first of all, you got to get across the line at the right time or it's going to break too, too much. And you only see a small piece of that yellow. Clean. Yep. Six straight briar appearance for Brad Thiessen. Made that look easy. And maybe, and you talked about it, but maybe not talked about enough how good this front is and is for Brendan Botcher. You know, you, you can't, you cannot win at this level without an unbelievable front end. You've seen it with Gushu. Uh, you know, Brad was what? Gushu was maybe, I don't know, 12, 13 bars before he won one. And that was partly because he just had to get that much stronger front end, and he did. And, you know, they've worked at it for a decade to get to the Olympics again. And we, these guys just don't get enough credit for their shot making ability and their weight judgment because of their hulks. They're so powerful. I think we got a yeah. hog Shit. stone. It's all right. <laughs> Bound to happen eventually. <laughs> yeah. Not unusual for New Brunswick. Most of the surfaces are flat. You, you get here and it's like liquid ball bearings. It's just so quick out of the hack. Tough one here for yeah. Paul. We'll get another look. It's all muscle memory and he's sliding out like he normally does, but just gets there too soon, yeah. Just the last finger touch. True. So you'll see the lights go on. It'll flash red and right away the rock is pulled. Mm -hmm. Uh, that, I, that, that was an over. That was flashing the whole It was way. flashing red. Okay, line's that good. That wasn't over. So they don't think it's line's over. Good. So they have to, Way's if they good. don't Let's believe it, have it. to let the rock come to a rest and then appeal the decision. They will have an official take a look. Hard. And if, in fact, the batteries are malfunctioning, then it's fine. Hard to stop, hard to stop. Yeah. So yeah. this was flashing red, though, I believe, before even threw the stone. 
So when they go to clean it and reset it. Flashing red the whole slide. That was in my hand. It's flashing red the yeah. whole slide. Yeah, there was red lights the whole way out of the hack. I can, I can go to the back and start it. This is the next rock. This one, I believe it starts red too early. That one was it was red already? Yeah. yeah. It was like right there. as he was sliding out of the hack. Oh. Yeah. So the chief umpire is Diane Barker, deputy chief umpire Brenda Rogers for this event. There's Brenda right there. It'll be resting back there in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> and the difference between yeah, the okay. two is in the yeah. first case where the New Brunswick team felt that he was over. They stopped you know I mean? the rock immediately. Be, in the second there. case, they sure didn't that. feel that it was a problem, but you cannot remove a stone and have it tested. You yeah. must let it come to rest yeah, and then appeal one. it. I'm not sure about that anymore. <laughs> um, you got anything left now? After this? You got anything left after this or what? Um, I think there's going to be one mixed doubles event in oh, yeah, okay. end of March in Leduc. Yep. Which is good. That's kind of the event they put on in New York. Yeah. Yeah. And then there should so be right about, keep an eye for red there. Sounds like it. And he had, and that was well before, so it was red before he released the stone. I don't even mind, like... All right, so now we'll go back to Paul Dobson. Now watch his finger and the hog line. And there's that sensor in the ice just before the hog line, and your hand has to be off of it before it gets to there. I think it's a very different story than what we saw with Pat. Mm -hmm. Well done. And those lights didn't go off red until after the hog line, where the discrepancy here is for the other stone that was released. Obviously, the light was red before Pat actually even got to the hog line. It was red. So now Chief Ice Technician Greg Wasco making his way out and he'll have a conversation with Brenda Rogers. Yeah, one of the players put their uh, feet around it to give you the, uh, the spot that they're gonna move it from. And this is what you would do if somebody throws the wrong color in a game. You put your feet like that, you remove the stone, and you replace it. So James will stand there so that when the stone goes back, if it goes back, it goes back to the same place. And Russ, what's the procedure? You lift the rock, you clean it like that, you put it down, it resets? That's how it, yeah, that's how you set it. That's exactly right. Well, we need to re rewind the camera. It was flashing the whole way from the second he crossed the back line. Even James said it was time. Oh, well, then we need to talk to Diane. Yeah. The unfortunate part is James Gratton looks like a penguin and he can't move. Yeah, <laughs> He's got his feet. <laughs> Only you would notice that. <laughs> See, like, give him a break here. No, I can't do that. So clearly then they decide that that stone, it was a malfunction, it stays in play, oh, game carries on, and now it's on. Oh, yeah. They're in molding. And uh, it looks like I didn't quite hear it at the end, but James did what James would always do. Uh, he uh, he realized the rock was faulty and let them uh, let them put it back. Very nice. That is definitely a gentleman's move. Is it ever? It's a tough situation, uh, Kathy, because when two in a row, you start thinking, well, maybe our rock was faulty, and it it, it clearly wasn't. But the camera angle. 
Do you guys remember that back to back like that though in a game? No, even though never. you can see the nope. discrepancy, it was different, yeah. but still, never. you're right. It does yeah. put dote in your mind, doesn't it? And then I guess the other strange thing is all of a sudden it tested, uh, tested like it was working, and it really wasn't. That's the frightening part. Yeah, is it ever? Eh? We're pretty high. Yeah. That's what they call a false positive. Yeah, go ahead. You've heard go that ahead, in the news. Keep it going, Hart. Keep it going, buddy. Keep it going. 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 Keep it Are they trying to hit the higher stone here, Russ? They come around and hit yeah, the, the higher red? Yeah, the one, in, the one that's buried, yes. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, the back one, I think, would be too hard because of the way, way it curls in here. So right. get the top one and maybe roll behind your corner and you've got a nice little end going. I'd have to go, Paul. So by the yep, guard, yep, 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 roll it. hit the high red stone Fire, and yeah, flip behind that that's corner, right. pops out a little bit. Very but very pretty well done. Boy, Darren, good toss. All right, Kathy Goche, Howard, Dunstone, Sheetsy. Uh, Glenn Howard, a little bit like last night, has made some wonderful shots with his first, but not his second. Matt Dunstone was facing three on his first. He made a hit and roll. That is the shot stone. And Glenn trying to draw down to it. It's the stone in the back 12 foot. And so not only did it not get shot, but it didn't take away the, the open chance for Matt to get two. Needs full eight foot. 18th appearance at the Briar for there, Glenn Howard. Remember, he had the awful snowmobile accident mm. and actually didn't play in the bubble in Calgary. Wayne Madaw came in for the team. Matt Dunstone back as a wild card team. Oh, so close the last few years. Probably tired of that bronze medal finish. He's ready for the next step for sure. And that is a lovely draw from Matt Dunstone. So he's got the lead, 2-1 after three. Sorry, sir. Nice job. Good job boys. I can't see any of it, so we definitely can't chase. Yeah. Thanks. Just right. half, like, kind of in the middle of the two of them? Yeah. For yeah. depth? Yeah. No, I think they just the decided they can't get that uh, their Brunswick That's rock, so they're going to guard the shot yeah. rock and uh, take their Can chances. The but James Lass. will have a short raise. Yeah. A little oh. late. Line's good. Hey, Min for well, weight. Just half. Line's good. Hey, line's Halfway. good. Halfway. Yeah, half. Not line's even. Line's good. Line's good. Halfway high. Yeah, pretty high. Right beside the red. Right beside the red. Right beside the red. Easy. If it goes too far, it's going to leave another hole. Sit down. Sit down. That's good. Just that little tick helped. Good. So do you ever take on that raise? Yeah, that's good. That's good. Or you, you could peel the double peel the top and then see what we get after that. If anybody's gonna make it, it's me. me. Yeah, I think it's possible. <laughs> yeah. Like just here. I'm laughing because I played I with know, James. I like and that we, too. In uh, down east you have to learn to throw a, like, a soft handle with less rotation and here it's a weapon if you can control it. And that's what he I was referring to. Three inches That's what so we call you in the double. booth, a weapon, a weapon. if we can <laughs> control you. Let's make the double, okay? Looks so like. by make the double, just yeah, open it up here. Yes. Is that the play? Yeah, and then it's, no. it, then <laughs> Botcher kind of has to guard it again and there's the angle race for two. I'd rather leave him a double Got than it. a soft something, right? Clean. Oh, oh. Curl. Curl. James Grattan Curl. with his first. Curl. Clean, clean, clean. We're good, we're good. And where does that shot, red shot one James. go? Right by everything and back of the house. Yeah, I like that. More weight. I'm seeing yeah. it. Much we can do Update on now on Sheet A, a Kathy. Well, that redstone that is shot, that is at the top of the button, was just hit and rolled on the final stone by Thomas Scoffin. So Tyler's trying to run the stone back, make the double, and have the yellow stone that is currently second shot be the counter. Hurst! Hurst! 
Hard right to it. Hard right to it. Oh boy, this could be real bad. Oh. Over curled. Two. Two. Yep. So for Scoffin, that four he yep. scored the first time UConn's ever scored a four, and now a steal of a few more and a 6 3 lead over Todd or Smith out of PEI. Easy. Line's good. Line's good. Shade tight. Straight. Is it the park? Okay. Wait's, wait's not bad. Whoa. Like it's wide. Whoa. Easy. Wait's Easy. good. Just die. Sit. Sit. Beauty. Oh boy. Pretty good. nice guard. Nice shot. Updates continue, Kathy, with Newfoundland, Labrador, and Alberta. Well, Nathan Young in some trouble this end. Kevin Cooey drew around a guard to lie three on his first. And on his final stone, Nathan ticked the guard. And so that allows a draw to the paint for four. The youngest team here, Nathan Young and his squad out of St. John's. And Kathy, they're an up and coming team and already some success going to a Briar before Canadian Juniors. Uh, and just some wonderful tactics and some great shot making. But you're playing Kevin Cooey, and they're definitely more rattled than they were last night. Soak it all in. Wins, losses, get all that experience at your first ever Briar. And yeah, ends off against the four time champ. So Alberta leads 6 1. Spectacular rock positioning there yeah, for a lot of reasons. You, it choked yeah, off that yellow raise for two. Now you have to raise the wrong color. If you make a mistake, like P.I. Yeah. just did, it's a steal of two. And you've guarded a rock that's on basically in the button. It leaves James Grattan. The pin to same get a single. Perfect rock yeah, position. On this side, yep. Foot higher, he's playing the yellow rays for a deuce. That's probably why he's wearing that jacket on his back, right? That's right. <laughs> yeah, how true. <laughs> Whoa. Please. So James Grattan, final door. stone Whoa. here in three. Yep. Might have to Whoa. Do Whoa. Curl. Curl. Should curl. Wait's good. Real back hard. eight. Curl back means eight. Andy curl. McCann on the brush. Trying to carve it over in a hurry and just not enough. Right, It'll wick, it will roll, yeah. and it will be a steal of one for Brendan Botcher and Team yeah. Canada. Definitely there. Two nothing the guard in our feature yeah. from NMAX Center. And it'll be three straight Canadian championship. Kerry Anderson. Kerry's team, you're strong. You got it. You guys are so consistent i haven't seen anything like this in years i can't say enough good things about that team i think they've been dominant over the last quad good luck we're cheering for you we know you're the best just play the way you're capable of and and have some fun i'm sure they're going to enjoy it so much and i'm so glad that's you know able to happen for them this year and hopefully they'll go kick some butt give her hell out there uh, we're all pulling for you super proud of you guys just to go out there and do the same thing at the world championships and bring it all home for canada you won the Canadian Championship, won the Scotties. Let's go out and prove that you're the best team. Good luck at the Worlds. We're cheering for you. Totally deserving of that Scotties victory. I can't wait to watch him, Prince George, go out there and compete and wear the Maple Leaf. They're going to be great out there. And just make sure uh, Coach Reed gets fed on time. He gets a little hangry. Don't take anything for granted. And uh, give her. We'll be watching. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> oh, that's so good, isn't it? <laughs> oh, well done. And we echo all of that. Team Kerry Anderson, it all begins March 19th. BKT Tires and OK Tire World Women's Championship, Prince George. Awesome. And we can't wait to cover it. Cheering on Team Canada. Lots of Team Canada support in the building. And Kathy Russ, with the pandemic, right, did the teams not a few years back, showed up, were ready to play, and COVID yeah. sadly took it away. Yeah. So well, that's awesome. Yeah. It is a full circle for Carrie and her team. That is where they were supposed to go and then had the bubble. And so now they get to go back where it all started for them, this time with family and friends and the entire nation behind them. Guar guaranteed playoff spot for Team Canada. Because look at last year. They had the Scotties. They had the mixed doubles. They had two Grand Slams. They had the Worlds. It, it was just too much. They were all burned out. You're away from your family way too long. The, you know, the uh, situation, just the, just the COVID situation alone was tiring. And uh, they'll be ready for this one. Look out. If I'm not mistaken, like the teams had arrived too, yes, right? It was yeah, ready to yeah. Like just what a heartbreaker to to be ready to put on the Maple Leaf and and for Kerry and that team for yeah, the first time as a team, right? Yes, Together, sure. so good for them, and we wish them best of luck. Weight's good. Yep. Yep. Good control. Yep. Hard. You might Hard. get a wall. 
Right to it, right to it, right to it. Roll it a bit. Good. Okay. Good. Same thing. Yeah. This is probably medium or firm. So we're, we're trying to kill the, the back rib? one, but keep your shooter. Okay. You like firm? Sure. Is this a head off nose then? Or? Like, I think is we it, can keep is both. Is it easier but. to just get rid of? Is it easier just to straight peel it? Sure. Like, whatever. There's what? About four, four inches of separation if you like that. You Dead on yeah, is like just it. as good as hitting it super thin, so it's kind of like thrower's preference here or what spot you know. Clean! Clean! Yep! Yep, hard, hard. 32-year-old Brad Thiessen. Hard! Hard! Ah, oh boy. Precision as he picks the yellow out. Very good. Come on on that one. No late. Oh, almost missed it. You know, Kathy Russ, one of the cool things too, it was tough with the pandemic, but after winning in the bubble, Team Botcher all got a chance to take the Briar Tanker, did some cool things. I think it showed up for Botcher a stag. It went to some cottage parties. They took it on the boat. It was on a golf cart. Really neat to actually get to share it with friends and family and have some opportunity with that wonderful tankard with family and friends. I think that's just wonderful. I don't know if they do that with the Scotties. They certainly didn't when I had the opportunity to win because it would have been so awesome to take to my office, to take to Ottawa where I was half the time, to share it with the people who filled in behind me and carried me at my work life when I was actually curling. So I think that's a wonderful tradition. And Russ, you always talk about too, you bring that gold medal home as a part of Team Canada and the chance to share it, oh. like the impact it had for you as a person after you won it. It, it, it really is life changing. It's just amazing. And, and, the, and, the, uh, and Kathy can speak to the joy when people see the trophy yes. or, the, or the medal. And yes. it, 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 it is pretty special. I think you yeah, talked yeah. about going back to Newfoundland Labrador and going oh, to small yeah. communities and getting to, to oh, showcase just, it to just win. Unbelievable, the reception and the rock was just off the charts. It's fantastic. Good scrub. Beauty. Great shot. Lovely touch to tap the yellow. New Brunswick stone away, and yeah, what a beauty. That is what it's all about. The Briar Tankard. First one way back in 1927, and what a feeling it must be when you get to reminisce and Botcher, Molding, Thiessen, and Carrick Martin. No one can ever take that away from them as they are on the trophy, and he's trying to put his name on it for the second time, as is Darren Molding. Kevin Cooey, a chance to make history this week, win his fifth as a skip. No skip has ever done that. Furby has six but just four as a skip, so it's a pretty special trophy. Update time, Sheet C, Howard Dunstone, Kathy. Well, Matt was facing two on his yep. final stone. There was a yellow underneath whoa, whoa. Scott's foot. That was Matt's final stone, was trying to hit and roll underneath those corner guards, but rolled a little bit too far, and so already lying one, Glenn needs full 12 for two. No, saw on her feature, it. Darren wiggled right through, and the one red remains. You had a chance to talk with talk. Glenn Russ and, and the knee, and how is it feeling after? Yeah, he, he, he said it starts off really bad and just gets better and better and better, and, and he, he did in his first game. He did, like, really didn't show up for the first five ends, and then they came back and almost won that game against Team Canada, and he looks really sharp tonight. And there you see, yeah, nice shot there, so a 3-2 lead for Howard. Your line's good. Pat Jansen from late, Pickering, Ontario. Your line's good. Line's good. Just get into my broom. Line's good. Line's good. You gotta go. You gotta go. You gotta go. You're good there. Beauty. Great. Good scrub. Perfect. Perfect. Nice shot. I got a quick time on that. Yeah. At 15 3, but even if it was 15, Talking with Mike Fournier before his game against Gouche earlier today, and the one he, thing he said, I think it echoes the top yeah. teams. The top teams, you put the broom, we need it here, yeah. they throw it there. Yeah, that's right. The rock placement's insane. It, it, it is. It's absolutely insane. Partly the great ice, but a lot of it is the, the judgment of these wonderful front ends. Andy, 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 go. Yep, yep, yep. 
A little flip, top okay. four. Good toss, Darren. I think I like that intern pass. Intern? With easy. Okay. Edge of the rock. Do we try and roll my way or we just give him a double? It was just like the only spot you, like. <laughs> if you're hey. a little wider, you hit the thin double. Yeah. Should have got maybe Paul. I like the throw was good, hey? Mm -hmm. So much mutual respect between those two, a big reason why Darren took the invitation. James said literally he waited about a week, reached out. You heard the story. He talked about it on the broadcast. We played his clip of what he said, and he said that the one thing maybe we don't see, what a teammate. Darren has worked so hard to fit in to be a great teammate to them. Fantastic. There's more to it than uh, just showing up at the rink, isn't there? Clean. Clean. Whoa, clean, clean. clean. Whoa. Love to yeah. roll a couple feet whoa, to take whoa. away the double. Whoa. Roll it, roll it, any roll. Roll, roll. That boy, pretty good. Oh, that's real good. Great shot. Not bad. Close. <laughs> real close. Your dad. Okay. Yeah. Could you? Probably the old guy. Okay. Get a half under. Half or rock blank, maybe. Yeah. Just okay, buddy. Control this time. Yep, you got it. We'll put it up. Hi, Mom. There you go. <laughs> oh, wait, bud. <laughs> Just a little roll your way again. What are you throwing? Just control this time. Okay. Got to get under, so. Yep. All right, Kathy, back to work. Let's check in on Alberta, Newfoundland, Labrador. Well, Nathan Young made a hit and roll facing three on his first. He was second shot. So Kevin Cooey capped it off, and it is that guard that Nathan is trying to run back directly onto his own, directly onto the Cooey stone for the single. Whoa! Whoa! Yep! Yes! 19 years of age in his Briar debut. Oh, just misses the red. What an effort. Oh, that was just so close. A steal of one as the 19-year-old so close lives in Torbay, Newfoundland, Labrador, getting his Bachelor of Commerce and That's Bachelor of Arts easy, at Memorial yeah. University, and I bet a name we will see for years to come at this yeah. competition. No question. The exact same lineup won the provincial Newfoundland junior. So I th believe for the first time ever, it's the same team going to Breyer and the Canadian Junior. It's amazing. What a story. All right, Kathy, back to you again. She day. Well, Thomas Goffin has had some great draw weight. Both of those stones in the Media. forefoot are his. And Tyler Media. tried to freeze down to it on the first came light. And that is why Scoffin went around again. And so now he faces two, needs the button. Okay. Line's good. Line's good. Close. A lot of brother combos out here at this year's Briar. We talked about the Kennedy brothers that are competing, the Cooey brothers, obviously, and Chris Gallant is the alternate as well for PEI. And it will be two as that spills off and just not going Smith's way in this contest. 8 3 for Yukon. You had here, I, I sold the mark. Same spot. We can, we can judge it off of his last one. Yep. Uh, by the four. That one I threw uh, through the hole there when I wrecked. Can I judge it off that? Yeah. You said I was like T-line there? Yeah. Yeah, you were T-line there. Just like probably more top four. Yeah, I would oh, say okay. it's just so a shade light than yeah. T-line on the one he wrecked on. Speed should be pretty close to the same. Would this be something, this would be something you know draw to the button in the warm-up? Yes, this yes. And James alluded to it. He, he threw one here, and he just wanted to reconfirm at the front end if it's Line's similar good. speed. Line's so Flato Stone in four. New Brunswick trying to score their first point. A draw against two. All you! All you! Would love to drag it to the pin for their skipper, but they got to work, and they are working. Again, and Dobson, they haven't stopped. Need a big drag to try and get it. Pull eight, maybe a little bit more, and they will pull it and pull it. And is it enough? I think just shy. It's one. Yeah, one red. Yeah. So Team Canada, another steal and a three nothing advantage over James Grant. One. 
Three singles on the board for Team Canada with Hammer for Botcher in two, and then a steal in three, steal in four, so three, nothing. Here in five, James Gratton Hammer, Yellowstone's trying to get his first points of the game. Line's good, line's good. Top 12. Yeah, wait good. Line's good. Right to it. Line's good. Almost to it. See Karak Martin, his first it's top four. Set. Line's good. Nice shot. Oh boy. Good. Great shot. And the second one, top eight. We're talking to break, Line's Kathy tight. and I, uh, Brian, I, I, I would argue yeah, that James early. probably threw pretty Great. close to the weight he wanted. It was just there. maybe a little softer, yeah. as we say in New Brunswick, uh, New Brunswick release. And it there's just that much more friction when you don't have the rotation. And think of it as a car tire. Good. You're trying to get out of the snow and you floor it. You're just going to spin and you're not going to grab and go anywhere. And it's the same thing. So I, I think what's fooled New Brunswick on a couple of shots is the hog-to-hog <laughs> -hog timing. You hear people saying 15-3, 15-2. Not for Gratton. If he's going to throw a little less rotation, Halfway. he's got to throw that a little bit harder. And don't forget that because these rocks were recently Halfway. sandpapered, I talked to Greg Owasco before the game, as they're crossing that center line, as they're coming down, they're starting to cut and curl, cut and curl, and that also takes weight off. No question. And, and to what we're talking about with less rotation, it's going to really curl. Easy early. Greg Owasco is the chief ice well, technician at this Easy. year's Briar, familiar name. Especially to these curl. curlers who really enjoy his curl. ice. Definitely has to curl. Now you guys Cut talked about rotation. We did chat during the break. I think the young Bruce Mowat and his team, didn't they, Kathy, not make a conscious effort to change releases so they all had the same yes. amount of rotation on their team for that consistency? They all throw a lot of rotation. They all throw it the same. So for Bruce, when he puts the broom down, he knows exactly what to expect from every single player, and that includes himself. <laughs> a couple of nice corner guards here for New Brunswick. Is, even though there's a lot of red down the middle, they can disappear in a heartbeat. Ball can throw it hard. Oh. Help. 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 Okay. Okay. Good shot. Good shot, Paul. He'll get two moving. Good shot. Sticks the shooter. It almost touched the back one. It almost it just skimmed the back one. Did it? Yeah. Good shot. Not heavy. Your line's good. Russ, did you guys take the Briar Tankard anywhere back in the day during your wins? Did you have that opportunity? Line's no, good. no, we actually didn't now that I think of it. Always pass. No. Close. Close Wouldn't pass. fit on the horse. Yeah. <laughs> it's before our automobiles. Hard. Very true. <laughs> oh, man. Hard pass. That uh, back to the Gucci one, though, right? right? That, like when they uh, mosh pitted the. Oh, in St. Oh, John's. That was crazy. Three in the morning, it's the, they passed it to the fans. That was an unreal scene. Okay, or last, or last. Car. No. That trophy could write a book. I would buy mm -hmm. it. <laughs> oh, 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 yep, straight. Oh, 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 oh. Straight back, oh, and this oh, is a real close. Straight. straight. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Paul Dobson again, run Set. it back. Oh, boy. he'll stick it. Nice shot. There's a teaching point for all the skips coming up. James Play Gratton ball. asked for like a control weight, which allows the br brushers to make it go a okay, shade boss. left and right. You throw peel there, you've made it or missed it out of your hand. Perfect weight choice. Either or. Ooh, that's a small thinking? port. Play this, just medium. I like this okay. better, yeah. yeah. They're actually playing the run back. Firm. Whoa. Whoa. Firm. Firm. Whoa. Curl. Firm. Curl. Curl. Got a goal. Got a goal. And just a chip there from Patrick Jansen. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Half place. 
Let's go, Darren. Spike. Okay. It's good speed, hey? Yep. I'd say full speed. It felt good speed, yep. No chance all of a sudden. Get one around the corner guards, and there's three of them in reality. Oh, top 12. Pearl. This Pearl. rock, if it's perfect, it'll be hard oh, to remove. Good. Top 12. Line's good. Just top. No, weight's good. T line. How's the line? Straight. Weight's good. Pearl. As this Always rock Pearl. from Darren Molding settles, we'll check in on Glenn Howard and Matt Dunstone. Well, Matt drew to lie two on his first, and there were no opportunities for doubles. And so Glenn hit and stuck. It is that shot stone. And for Matt, I think he needs to roll just a little bit to the center line side to ensure that it's for two. Yeah, dead on might not do it. It might not. Meantime, in our feature, you see Molding drawing in. So it is New Brunswick lying the two, trying to score their first score here in our feature in the fifth end. Off, Kurt. Jansen delivering his second of the end. There is the tap. There is that roll. And enough to move the red out. You bet it is. That's a nice shot. Touch shot from Dunstone. As he'll pick up a pair. Nice shot. And in our feature, yeah, my goodness. Making some good ones across the sheets of ice at Edmax Center. Like that. Hack. Yeah. Just quietly going about his business, is he not? Yeah, now we touched on it. I'd have to think uh, in the this type of situation, it's a lot of pressure on Pat Jansen. Yep. He's uh, three All points ahead of Darren. Not that that's a lot, but uh, on, he's Paul. holding his own so far. Gotta go! Hard! Quick! They Hard. do gotta go. That guard Hard. is coming up quickly. There it is. Can they scrub it by? They can. There's the tap. Get that red back far enough. Great. And push it back to lie to you heard though right at the end Darren saying Paul Paul and they almost Paul. forgot about yeah. that stone that you were at the back one right yeah. right Gotta go. Hard. Quick. Hard. It's the little things yeah. in a game like this that make a difference so true <laughs> Yeah, right there Spectacular weight Two perfect roll. stones by molding Good sweep bud Yeah. Sure. Yeah, I like no. Easy. Okay. I don't mind that. Interesting call. You, you'd think you'd think try to roll rolls. buried, but you're not going to be shot rock. Shot. Yeah. Darren's saying if, or sorry, uh, or Brandon's sick. saying if you hit this dead Unless on. Unless you want to try and roll big and just get shot out of it. No, I like this. But I don't think we're getting shot if we just roll behind the guard. You hit it dead on. Farther. No, I like this. Gratton rolls. It won't be closer than that red one that they almost didn't sweep. So then uh, they'd only be laying one for New Brunswick. Rolling Barry doesn't give him shot rock anyways. So board. Clean. Clean. So on board. Whoa. Clean. So on board. Easy Clean. down. Whoa. So on board, easy down. Curl. 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 Hard. Hard. Yikes. Watch the jam. Get it going. 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 Okay. And is that third shot stolen? I believe it is. No question. I like that throw. I didn't see that falling the whole way down the yeah, sheet. It didn't. It fooled them. They, they were quite calm about the release. Oh, sorry, Pat. I didn't hate that throw. It, it was a good throw. Just hung the whole way. They were yelling board, and I was expecting it to move a bit. Yeah, me too. Just if we go around, we got to be full four unless he freezes. Yeah. I, I don't. If he free, he could freeze there and be shot. <clears throat> yeah, bite the four. Okay. I don't think it matters what turn though, Darren. No, nope, whatever you like. Might, uh, might like this one. Okay. Yeah, like you got that. it. <laughs> the ice is so good. As, in this case, uh, James might refer to the front so end. How, if they know the yeah, path because yeah. they're the ones that have to put it on the X. Path a lot here. It's just coming off the off the fans here, it's just not carrying. What does that mean, Russ, that Fight comment? Just a shade slower, maybe hog line in, and, and whether that's 
wear and tear because it's warmer on that side. The ice may be starting to flatten out a little wee bit. But good information from Andy. Line's good. Don't kill it want. early. Wait, it's close. Okay, wait only. Yep. Have a look for me. I gotta go. Yep. We gotta go. Line's good. Line's, Line's, good. Line's, good. Close. Wait, Line's good. Just play the weight. We're there. It doesn't bite need four. to curl. Bite four. Straight. Gotta go bite four. Straight. Straight. Whoa. Whoa. It's there. It's, it's all there. Don't let it over curl now. Sit. Sit. Ha. Huh. Okay. Okay. So settle side button and it pops out the other side. Slide, eh? But yeah, I'd like to see it at Team New Brunswick here and these guys are both my buddies so I don't want to throw them under the bus too much but they're but you will. <laughs> they're yelling it's there or it's fine or it's whereas most of the teams are going it's a four it's a five it's a four it's right. fine. And, and it gives the uh, in this yeah. case molding who's in charge of the house a little bit of idea where that how much it's going to curl because of the speed. Nobody ever said T line. And right. they, so they kept brushing it. Now it's over curled. And those are the things you just learn at this level. You know, if you play enough. I got half rock. I'm good with it. it. So we know it's half. So I'm good with that. You want to come Give down and have a look with it? Right? Yeah. yeah go back. I think it makes sense like to it. hit it because you three up. And it's because the three is the three. You just bump, punch it out. Two's not bad here. I thought you three years pretty nice. Yep. Like that. Okay. Yours didn't do anything crazy. I just left it a little long on the sweep. Okay. Is that the call then, Russ, with that broom, the tap, just quiet yeah. tap? Yeah, hack weight. Now, the unfortunate part for uh, Team Canada is that I think they'll roll right. I don't want, I, they might be able to roll underneath now that I think of it, but just killing it guarantees you a one point lead with hammer. You rope curled this end. Don't do anything stupid really here. The left. freeze is a great call. If you ever miss it, you give up three. You might be able to get underneath here. It really depends on their stomach, <laughs> whether oh, they've got the hack. nerve to uh, shave that guard. Whoa. Well, you got the Whoa. pressure certainly to move Please. it over if Please. you choose to. Yep. So Brendan Botcher, Whoa. Team Canada, Whoa. his final Please. stone here in yep. five. Yep. Can't tap on the back one. Whoa. Can't tap it on the back Whoa. one. Whoa. And there's that jam, but I think they got away with it. Did they? It's close. I think oh, okay. you're right. Wow. Oh, yeah. We are good. Yeah. And you hear Karak say they're okay. We are good. Are they three? Oh. If they hit it? They didn't get you. I didn't think we could. We, it was lucky we got a little roll off the jam. Oh, did we? Yeah. Down. Yeah. I think dead jam might have been. So it looks like a similar shot. Quiet tap yep. for Grattan to score two. Yep. Shade tougher. It's a little more underneath, but it's, it's definitely there. That, we can jam and be fine. Yep. Okay. It's for their for two. two. Yeah, they, yeah. They can jam so now to score their two and they're all right. Let them know what the weight yeah. is. What are you throwing? Trying for hack. Okay. Okay. Same as he just had. Final stone, New Brunswick. Wait, good. James Gratton here in five. Whoa. Whoa. A Whoa. chance Whoa. to get his team Whoa. on the board. Yeah. Straight, straight, a chance whoa. to get this crowd going at Edmax Center. Clean. Touch Girl. heavy. Girl. Girl. Clean. 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 Just clean it. Oh boy, James. Boy, James. A little clean. Yeah, James, that a boy is right as he will slide it through. And the crowd approves. New Brunswick, Gratton on the board. It is 3 2 to get it. Our first Saturday night at the Briar in Lethbridge. A lot of great shots already as we bring you AGI Top Shots. Oh my goodness, what a run back shot and stick it to boot. Unbelievable. So tough. He throws this three feet heavier than he wants to. It won't, take, won't even touch it. 
can't wreck on his own. If he does, he gets probably gets two, but he needs that three to get back in this game. It's all a line shot. Johnny's got to be careful this doesn't break early. Clean. Whoa. So final still Whoa. here in oh. six. Clean. Hard. Yeah. Come on, Beach. Clean. Whoa. Whoa. Clean. And Clean. now off. You hear John Morris in the house calling Clean. line and wait. Let's, Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Trying to come back Quite to that yellow little tap. That is perfection. <laughs> a perfect tap and three for Alberta. And there is your answer. Vote for your favorite AGI Top Shot every day at Curling Canada on Instagram. Top Shots is brought to you by AGI Storage and Handling Equipment for Agriculture. Expecting a lot more Top Shots as the week goes on. And a little momentum now for Team New Brunswick as they pick up their first deuce. And that brings us to the story after five. 3-2 advantage. Russ Howard, what are you looking at thus far through the first five? Just a couple of shots. I think Team Cam's been a little bit better, but James had to draw the pin in the third end, hair heavy, and then he came up light in the fourth, maybe a little less rotation, it slowed it down a little bit. Therefore, a 10% difference, but two last end. That changes things completely. After five, brought to you by Russ yeah, Howard, who didn't bring his wallet to breakfast again this morning. <laughs> Thanks. Team Canada, all smiles. What a thrill to be in your home province wearing those colors. He leads by one. The Tim Hortons Briar is brought to you by Tim Hortons, the official coffee of Curling Canada. By BKT Tires and OK Tire. By Home Hardware, here's how. And by Sponge Towels, made for real life messes. wanted to do a lot of things to be ready to play in this prior and for our team and probably more than some of the teams here it was the focus of our year in the last two years we've had a pretty good first pool and then kind of slowed down and hopefully this year we can carry a little bit of that momentum through definitely have a little bit of a challenge bringing in a new player that'll be the biggest test for us is getting cold and comfortable and you know opening weekend for us the first 48 hours is really making that as seamless as possible And that is our feature when we return tomorrow morning, 10.30 a.m. Eastern time. Mike McEwen winning his opener, Team Manitoba, versus Jason Gunlickson, who lost his opener. Look forward to bringing you that coverage. Colton Lott in for Colin Hodgson, unfortunately, and sharing some messages with Colin. He recovering from COVID. Also, his body's a little bit banged yep. up as well, so we wish him the best and getting healthy. But, Kathy, what an opportunity for young Colton Lott here at the Briar. Well, it is. We've seen Colton so many times before, not only the Canadian juniors, but of course the mixed doubles. And then, of course, he stepped in to play third for Matt Dunstone at the Olympic trials this year. And when Mike talks about, you know, fitting Colton in, it's not about ability. It's just about finding the chemistry and how everyone's comfortable and working well together. And we're seeing that as well in our feature with Darren Molding, a new face coming together. And a nice job scoring their first two. So here in six, Team Canada has Hammer back, leading by one, Top throwing 12. the Red Rocks. Top 12 fine, have a look. Almost a three uh, when Botcher jammed the one. If it hadn't got rolled a, a little bit, it would have been a tap for three. It's good. Always got a curl. Want to be okay, curl. Now go. Come on, yep. Now it's go. Light. It's light. Keep going. Got it. Okay. Oh, you. Nice. Oh, Boy, nice ball. shot. You can hold it so much with this week. Another update, Alberta, Newfoundland, Labrador, Kathy. Well, Kevin Cooey drew in on his final. He does lie too, but he set up a sharp double. And that is what Nathan is chasing, an opportunity for two if he's able to make it. Close. Ben, Ben, Ben. Trying to score a pair against the Ford time prior champ. You got it. One, two, stick it. Well done, Nathan Young. Nice double, picks up a pair. As Kui leads 7 3 after five. And it's funny, too. Well, not funny, but it's an interesting story. Brad Gushu saying they kind of lost their coach and alternate, Jeff Thomas, who's moved yeah. over and he's coaching these youngsters. And obviously, with uh, tongue in cheek, a big blessing because he brings so much experience to this young team. Obviously, Brad. You know, they know what they're doing. They're, they're, they're pretty yeah, good yeah. squad with yeah. Jules Ochar still there as well. So that's, that's a really nice story. And 
No, it's fine. Two. Excitement for this young team out of the rock. Always straight, too. Nice to Always see straight. another uh, team coming up with this much desire. Boy, Polly. Straight back, absolutely on the nose. Might get the top yellow pass Clean. to Botcher's red. Clean. Oh, he's just playing the peel. Tight, it's fine. Yeah, we're good. Let's throw it back to you, Kathy no. Goche. This time, yeah, Ontario wild card done so. And it has been done so, lying too, for much of this end. Matt hitting on his final stone. No real double opportunity to bring that buried stone into play. So, this is the force needs to draw the piece of the forefoot for the single. How's Ontario looked in this contest, Kathy? They've looked, it's been a very good game. It's very, very back and forth there haven't been a lot Go of opportunities back. left i think that Go what you talked in. about is so true glenn's delivery early in the game is a little bit shaky four, four, with four, that four. knee but as it starts Throwing to loosen down. up really he just curling. looks more Go solid more comfortable his draw weights what's been spotty early and that Jeez. just picked I hate to see that yeah that is really unfortunate i i don't think there's any question he had draw weight yeah, and a three-point swing, too, isn't it? So Dunstone up by three after six on sheet C. Fuck right off. You heard um, Team Gushu had a couple picks, uh, but I haven't seen any other than that. And they're just keeping it clean. So very confident that the weight's there. Now they're just bringing it in, and you'll see it jump. Right there. Sideways. So trying to park that frustration for Team Ontario. Meantime, back to our feature. Interesting is rock positioning here, because both teams are kind of happy with the angles. Brad's got two buried lined up. But they've got to rearrange them, Botcher, and then he's in good shape. Right to it, right to it, right to it, right to it. Tap set yellow, now back button. Interesting. Who shot stone there, Russ? I, I think it's red, but it's really, really close. And I should have asked Kathy. Kathy, who shot stone there? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> wow, at least, at least I made an and she's effort. She's getting paid. Yeah. So, I mean, you have an excuse. So. Red. <laughs> I'll go red. I'll go red. I think we got to do it, though. You got to move, roll it to there, right? Bomb, eh? Yeah. Got to hit the inside. Right on the, yeah, right on Jeez, the nose is pretty good. If you, I, make, if you throw peel, roll there. Okay. Nose, yeah. I'm out of ink again. <laughs> we're we're going <laughs> to dead on, peel. maybe, maybe yep. cheat towards the center line a bit. And you're going to see an awfully big backswing out of Darren Molding here. This is old school. And he can throw it hard. You don't see it much anymore. I know no. Glenn Howard. Does it? Molding does it better than most. And here we go. The backswing. Here comes the heat. Curl, curl, curl. Big weight intern on the way. Roll it. He gets all three moving. Pushes the two red out to the wings. And shot stone is Team New Brunswick. Any more curl? I think he gets them. Could do. Yeah. I guess we could have hit a little further on the inside and got that other right. One. Yeah. A little thinner. You got the top one. Beautiful shot here. Yeah, the angles were not good. No. 
Heel. Still the, uh, the only way they're going to score a decent end here, Ken, is to make this double because the red ones, or yellow ones, right underneath covers. So you have to make that double, which you, you could take out one of your red on the way by. Pat Jansen trying to answer. Oh, slicing precision gets the yellows to go. Spills the red, but mission accomplished. Yeah, it's going to be tough not to hit your own red there. The, you're right. The key Good. thing was yeah. get rid of that buried so rock. Millimeter thicker. Good. Straight, hey? Yeah. I'm impressed Good with throw. Pat Jansen. He's, uh, he has, to my knowledge, hasn't played a ton of competitive curling, certainly at this level. I think there lately. was a spot we could have hit it, made the double and missed. Now we mentioned his second briar. He won a bronze cutting it a little close. with we Epping two years ago. Double. That's right. Second, yeah. The nice thing, too, with Botcher and, and Brennan, so much respect in talking about Patrick. They, they've known each other for years. It's not like this is right. new for them, right? He's been around the team. He's been the alternate a couple years in a row, and and it's pretty seamless to slide him into that role. Mm -hmm. Skip Stones here in six. Whoa, 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 whoa. Close to normal. Whoa. Heavy. Queen. Yeah. Whoa. whoa. Oh, my curl. Whoa. Curl. 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 Uh -oh. Got to hold the shooter. Six. Okay. And it will that hang works. out in the weeds. It would have been tempting for Team Canada to brush that. Brian, if you ever get that like out that. of there. Yeah, that was normal. Good. <laughs> Probably a good spot. Good huh? throw. I've seen it kind of run on this side so far. Okay, let's take where we got to hit it. You like good medium, Brandon? Really good medium? spot. Medium, because yeah. it, unless Botcher can stick this. If medium. he doesn't, James is going right around that it. center guard. Could have a tie game. These are the ones you, you think, ah, oh, rolled out, no big deal. It's a huge deal here. And I can't tell you what it's going to do with this no, wide. Sure, sure no. not taking much ice. No, it would be nice here. Every other hit we've thrown has been Kathy, we straight. heard from us earlier. Did you ever play in a Scotties in a home province or a Worlds? I did. I yeah. had the opportunity to play both a Canadians and a World Championships, both in Brandon, who have hosted some Whoa, wonderful me, events. Me. And it was... Yeah. It was terrific. There's just nothing better than your family and friends being able to be there and and especially in a world championship, having the crowd behind you, it's pretty special. We hear Cheryl, our good friend, always say, you know, pressure is a privilege. Is that how you viewed it? Was it did it just boost your team? Oh, so much so. You just you just realize how fortunate you are to be playing at that level in a sport that you love and and to have people really appreciate what you're doing. It's it's a gift. Yeah, Team Good. Canada is special, but Team Canada in your home medium, province, that's got that yeah, extra true. nugget, doesn't yeah. it? Oh, true. I kind of wanted to have it throw enough weight that I was pretty confident it would run straight. Yeah. Well, when, when you went down, I said good medium. You didn't hear me, so I just said medium. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it's good. Yep. Normal. Yep. So James yeah. Stratton, his final stone here in six. Whoa, oh. Trying to roll it buried. There's the hit. Here comes the Harder. roll. Couple more rotations to try and make Good. it interesting at the very least. Great effort. But it'll be wide open for the Good throw, James. blank for Team Canada. Good. Good throw. No. Real. Such a difference from last Reed. year where you'd hit a pin drop in the building yeah. and Reed. Yep. Yeah. hear Reed. those fans yep. having a good time. Reed. Final stone, Brett and Botcher looking for the blank and he will get it. Right. Deep Cannon with Hammer and a one point lead when we come back to Lethbridge. We'll step aside. Glad you're watching our prior coverage here on TSN on a Saturday night in Lethbridge. Blank on the board. There from Team Canada in six. So here in seven, once again, running Botcher, Redstones with Hammer, and a 3 2 advantage. Not a bad, it's not. Sit. 
Good. Won't bounce. Pretty good. If you have the weight to just touch it. Right, just, just touch a little, it. Yeah. You like that? Yeah. Just top four. Good this time. Top, Whoa. top four. Whoa. 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 Clean. Close. Whoa. Whoa. Weight's good. Whoa. Whoa. Weight's good. Top four. Whoa. Weight's good. Curl. Clean, clean. No straight. Clean, clean. clean. Weight's really close. good. Stay close. Clean. Yep. Whoa. 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 We're good. We're good. Great shot. Oh boy. Very good. Perfect. Well, Darren Molding was more free agent frenzy than Trade Center, but obviously this basically is hometown, and he was feeling the love from the building. Is this any fun or what? That's awesome. You know what? It's uh, That's just great. Literally is a memory you'll have for sure. Yeah, how true. You know, in this game. Curl. Curl. Yeah, heavy, James. Hi, gotta, gotta hit something. Keep going. Trying to carve it here for Paul gotta Dawson, trying you to get it. a piece of ground. Down a lot. Okay. Good. Good sweeping. Keep going. <laughs> gotta move on, the red. You got it. Right, it's you coming got down it. a lot. Well, if you got a lot of nervous energy or excitement, that's one way to burn it off, okay. isn't it, Russ? Good. I mean, yeah. 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 all he had yeah, to carve good. that over. It's funny, he's, he's, he's his inner Kark Martin, because like? that's the noise that Kark right makes. That's <laughs> right. <laughs> gotta kill it. The pressure that like these guys yeah. can put on the ice and yeah. lean on those brushes. Incredible. I wonder as this goes along and you, you know, the crowd's yeah, like pro molding, yeah. did, did Team Canada, being the home team, expect oh, that? Oh, oh. They're almost the villains Girl. right now. Girl. You know what? Girl. If you speak to every player, I think they'd Girl. love to be booed. They, they don't care. Right. Have the, the fans and the action. That was about as good as we were gonna yeah, look at that little shot, the little Ooh. spin up. Whatever. That was okay. an interesting point that Brad Jacobs made in one of his interviews. He chatted with Bob Weeks about it before he came. We like being cheered. Obviously, Mark Kennedy's from Alberta. They'll get those cheers. But we also like being the yep. villain. We like hearing mm. maybe the boos towards us because that fires us up. Yep. So you can, yeah. it's how you use it, right? Right, right. And you want to take the crowd out of it, even if they're not going to boo you. You just want to make them not cheer for the opponent. It's funny too, Kathy, how some athletes are built for it. Yes. They thrive off that. Yes. It doesn't matter. Ah. Drama, energy, some love it more. I can't see it. anyone in this building complaining this week about anything. Whoa. It's Whoa. just alive it's and it's exciting and it's something good. that good we shot. have all missed so much. Shot, Paul. Trading some nice ones here as Paul Dobson answers. Continue to move the angles around in the house. Try to control the top of that four-foot area. Angus. Yep. Easy. You got right it, Right on the nose. Right on the beat. Yeah. Well, a lot of cheering, too, for this Kevin Cooey team. Obviously based out of Calgary, just two hours north of Lethbridge. And another update, Kathy on sheet beat. Well, it is shot stone belonging to Kevin Cooey, but when Nathan is not able to cover the stone, he's trying to just squeak by the guard. If he can angle it and remove the yellow, it's for four, and if he keeps the shooter, it's five. Ben Heber on it, off it, tap, tap. Oh, there it goes. Jeez. Very, very precise. A big four on the board, and certainly one of the favorites, just by the yellow, and a nice tap. He made a heck of a shot in the extra end against Flash, as yep. well, remember, yep. kind of that little yep. tap instead of the draw, right, Russ? I yeah, mean, it, it, it took a while for me to even see if it was oh, possible, oh, and he just he, he just got that perfect angle with nice weight oh, and moved that yellow barely far enough. Yeah, oh, that was a really good shot, team shot. Back to our feature, Darren Molding. 
Quiet little double, shooter. Sticks around. Shot stone still, Team Canada back eight and fought your hammer here in seven. I slid tight. Oh, you, you got it to go. Like it was so Russ, it's one thing to pick up a new player in molding, but molding's in the house as well. So the adjustment of knowing James's release, right. James knowing his release, yep. and I guess just getting to know each other in that regard yes. as well. James is a very soft release, and uh, he throws more rotation than he did when he played with me, but it, it's still Mine's going to good. curl, and, and, it, and it's, you have to be able to anticipate that for molding, and it's her first time on arena ice easy, as a team, easy. and uh, they've done a wonderful job, easy. really. It's only been a couple shots this game. Line's good. Line's good. Go ahead. Yep. Hard. Wait's good. Just line. Wait's really good. And you know, Russ, speaking of taking care of business, tuning out the noise, how about full credit to Patrick Jansen, who's had a lovely game and also a key shot back at six. Real key shot, because if they don't get this buried one, and the only way he's going to do is make the double, uh, they could be either A, forced to one, or it's a steal to tie the game. Just picks it off clean. Yes, he lost one of his own, but it allowed for the blank and start all over fresh with the advantage of hammering. The key shot brought to you by OK Tire. It's going to be OK. Whoa, curl, 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 curl. Curl. OK, rolling right away. That's fine. Good shooting. Didn't quite get shot. That would have been spectacular underneath cover like that if it was shot rock, but it looks like it's red. Same speed here. Yeah, I'm with you there, Russ. Well, they're shrinking the scurrying yeah. area on Team Canada, but it's still a chance at two. Line's good. I did, I thought too close. You thought heavy? Weight's good. Okay. Line's good. I think heavy, but. A little bit. Yep. Okay. Hard line. Hard line. Oh, oh. Gotta go for weight. Yep. Hard line. Gotta go. Go, Kari. Gotta go hard. hard. You got a real good one. Hard, hard. Go. Go, go, go. Need a second. Go, 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 go. That's a good Whoa. shot. Nothing wrong with that. Didn't get there. Though. Third shot, I think. Ah. Nice. Who is it? Who is it right now? I think ah, it's then us. he just yeah. dealt. He played double it. I did. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I thought that was good. You just hit sit right there. I do think we are second shot. Right, no. Yeah. We, does that what does that do for us? He the only other the thing, thing I see is the run. Yeah. It's kinda, you know. Well, it's either knows this. Lie two. He what does he do? Plays a little tap. Yep. Make a and double. Then you're gonna have make a slash. Yeah, I mean he could get to the nose on the tap, but you can't, you can't play the tap here. No, I know. Do we ever, yeah. Time out, let's time out this. Time out. Time out. First time out for Team New Brunswick. Time out. Both teams get two timeouts of 90 seconds. We're <laughs> shot there. And the alternate we're, will come out, second. Jamie Brannon. For second, what's one, that one? First, second. <clears throat> I mean, obviously, you tap it, we lie too. Yeah, let's just shot. hit the back one. <laughs> the only other, we could do that. He either tap plays the roll or he plays the tap. I mean, yep. that bump, if he ever rolls that way, your your nose hit to sit five. Yeah, I know. Right? Yeah. It'd be hard not to leave you a double with this tap. Yeah. He, he has to get to nose. He can get to nose, but the nose is easy. If he makes the tap. What do you have? Do we make the tap? the tap after? It's pretty buried. Yeah. The other shot's the run right now. If you can make contact on this red, we're not in bad shape. On this red? Yeah. yeah. And then you might get them both. Yeah. I just, yeah, I, I hear what you're saying. It's, but don't we have the run on you the You almost second? have to, you have, you don't have to make it now, but you're pretty it's close. real close so you can get them both. I, I don't mind anything right now. Just hitting that back one, sit on the nose? No, I, yeah. That's not easy either, but. If he, if he makes that tap perfect, you're probably throwing the run on the next shot. Yeah. Yep. 
So it's now or that? Yeah. What? Say if I say if I miss the run, he just plays the tap. Yeah, it's all open. We're. He might hit. It hit and lie. Hit that top one. Yeah. He'd love to do that, but like, that's a high guys, degree of difficulty shot. This yeah. this makes a little more sense where you just just come down and that tap that sense. back, sit two, one, and let uh, let the other guy make the tough shot. The only danger I mean, with that is if you crease one. that red one on the way by and then Bodge is drawn for three. I like this. With his first rock. Like? Uh, whatever, I, I, I don't mind the out low. I, don't mind, I, I know the out better. Yeah. Okay. Any different thoughts from you, Kathy? Yep. Just inside the spot. Yep. No, I'm it's actually bad. watching Nathan Young make a triple, so. Okay, <laughs> uh, also fair. But then he didn't. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's make it, though. <laughs> Go, bud. I have three games to watch, you two. Got a cross it a hair. Uh, out turn. Yeah. Well, normally four if the Winnipeg Jets were playing. Well, maybe that they are. Is, I actually, I don't no, even know. No, they're not. Oh, thank you. No. Not till tomorrow night. Just hit it almost on the center line. Is real close. We'll definitely get the top one. A little thicker than that gets both. Whoa. So after the timeout, Curl. Skip Stones here Curl. in seven. James Grattan Curl. with his first. He'll kiss his yellow out. Oh, Team yes. Canada lying too. I want to leave him like a plug, right? In the second, third end, the third end, Brendan Botcher said to uh, Pat, I think I'd yeah, rather have him throwing him a run back a than a soft shot. Yeah. Or and I played with James forever. I had him throwing a lot of run backs and hits because he was playing third, but he's really good at the soft shot. So that, that might have been the shot he was talked into by Molding, I thought, more than anything. Cause I, I, that was a very, he wasn't far off, but that uh, that's a disaster right now. If we knows that one, he's probably playing a double. Do you like the draw? The draw? I think so, yeah. yeah. I think we, we want to talk about where we really want to leave this. 14 though. and a half. Like, is that better? Yeah, we definitely can't be deep enough that he can freeze and get four foot, right? Because yeah. that's his out. Like, I mean, is this the best? James Gratton's got the raise double, which he will be that awfully way, for close him to making. Roll that one in, he's almost dead jamming it here. You want to call a timeout right now? This is, sure. I mean, this is a big timeout. Shot. So Team timeout. Canada, their first this timeout. Is a big shot right now. Let's make sure we and right they one. have a great experience, said coach, and Don Bartlett, who will where, like, step out. Like this, but where do you want Two Briars with Kevin Martin them, right? in like, 97 Calgary, here. 91 in Hamilton. Try to get top eight. Yeah. What do you think, Don? Yeah, if you're, if you're going in the eight foot there, it's got to be far enough so that if he raises that one, yeah. We're, yeah. we're shot, right? Yeah. yeah. You don't like hitting that at all, That's eh? not bad. Or and if we're coming a hair deep, we try to carve it into here. Yeah, if we hit that drawing. one, he's drawing, he's back, he's drawing back into back the here. world yeah. back here. Well, well, I mean, if we lose this good, he's doing the same thing. He he's got to make it. Drawing, right? yeah. He's got to make it. What are we, yeah. I think, I think we put it here. He's just I think if we put it yeah. here, he's taking a double and happy to give us two. Yeah. And okay. I'm happy with two. Yeah. Okay. Sure. You like that? Yeah. 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 Right. Just make sure you don't count we, we that gotta get, run we gotta, back. We right? got to get there, though. Yeah. Watch. Yeah. Even just split the center line full top eight. Well, we do, he can nut it in there. Right, do we have enough of it if we do that? I guess so. You want a little across, hey? Maybe I got to shade across. Okay, so, so they can't the, nut it in behind. Oh, there was our yeah, I know. Even, like, I know. Mm. Yeah. He makes a double up and maybe yeah. you can get them all. Okay. Yep. If he's deep enough, you just make the top two. But there's a little bit of separation there. You, you can definitely manipulate that rock yeah. onto this side. Yep. Well, I was saying, if he, come, if he gets top four, though, we can hammer it in. He can't hit it. If we make the top double, mm -hmm. it's pretty tough. Yeah. <laughs> okay, just top eight. Yeah. So timeout called. Botcher settles in. This could be an audible on the way, you know, hog line in. Yeah, you know, if it's a little deep, you got to take it really deep. If it's a little light, it, easy, Brad. You don't really right want to set up a easy line's double good. off of this rock right either. Line's with good. the raise back. Line's good. Top eight. Well, line's good. Line's good. Line's good. Top eight. Top four. Oh. Where are we? We're top. Just by top four. For full four. Full four. Full four. And you heard they didn't want to come in too deep and give Gratton the out. Yeah, not uh, not ideal. I think that I think you might see James think about the freeze. If he glues it in there, there goes that whole end. Yeah, 
slight mistake there. Uh, Brian, it's, it's, you wanted him to play the raise. He makes the raise, even if he makes the double, that rock would be closer, yep. but because it's so deep, a perfect freeze. Both Paul and mine. Posh has got a tough one for two. It's funny too, and you always talk about the pro miss. Okay. They said it. Bosher was having that conversation mm -hmm. with Jansen. They said we just can't come too deep to That's, give them the yep. out, and they, and they did. did. And they did. Yeah. Yeah. Easy to do. Yeah, easy for us up here in the booth. Way easier. <laughs> Now this better be made though, or uh, that room. rock positioning is real good. Watch the room. Line's good. Line's good. Close. Line's good. Rate's good. Final stone. Room. James Gratton room. on the way here in seven Half without hammer. Yeah. Heavy. Trailing whoa, whoa, by whoa. one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Real close. We need curl. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, we're okay. It's there. It's there. Bouncing whoa. out. Whoa, 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 whoa. Needing this to finish up. Good. Curl nice up a little bit more. And it digs in. Second shot rock for now with one to come. Very I think it's good enough, yeah. Boy, James. Very nice. A, you're right, though. It took a while. So draw the side Actually, of the pin and collect your two. That's perfect, yeah. yeah. Good, good shot, shot buddy. Jeez, it took a while. Yeah. Nice shot, James. Great speed. Russ, it's one thing to see it from the overhead. Yeah, just draw and get. But when yeah. you sit in the hack visually, like the yeah. same how hard is this? Yeah, 100, uh, 146 yeah. feet away. Yeah, <laughs> it's just right. Looks so difficult. Yeah, and it is that difficult. Uh, yeah. How true. I think the same. This is, this is, uh, he can't really use his last one for uh, a bit of a teach because it, this is so much wider. I'm guessing quicker. But that's exactly what it is, an educated guess here by the brushers. Well, the stats say those four previous draws were pretty good. Final stone here in seven. Brendan Botcher, one in his back pocket, trying a very tough draw to pick up two here in seven. Oh, he's curled. Here comes the house. Here comes the curl. Molding waiting. Needs to dig in. And that slides too far. So that draw from Brad huge to take away a potential deuce. New Brunswick forces, they got hammer. And down by two when we come back. Ah. Welcome back to the Briar and Lethbridge. And there you see the updated score. Alberta cruising over Newfoundland and Labrador 12 to three. But obviously, Pretty cool story as Newfoundland Labrador, a young team here for the first time. And how about this young man? This is Nicholas Codner. He's the alternate. He's come in the game. He is 15 years old. And for the longest time, even before all the stats were actually recorded, we do believe he's the youngest ever to compete in a briar. For the longest time, teenagers not allowed to compete in this competition. That rule changed, I believe, Kathy, about six years ago. So what a thrill for this young man, Nicholas Codner. You got a story to tell. Welcome to the show, young man, at 15 years of age. Well, and I think an overdue rule change, if you are good enough to get here as this young Nathan Young team is, why not have the experience? Why not stay in the game instead of wondering what it would be like to go to a briar? These are life-changing moments in your in your life and also in your career. So it's just terrific to see him out there. Also worth noting too, pretty cool to see Carter Rycroft also into the game as he comes in as well for John Morris. Carter, we last saw him at the Briar back in 2016 in Ottawa with Pat Simmons, three-time Briar champ, obviously Olympian as well, winning a silver medal back in the day with Kevin Martin. So guy that we've seen wear those Alberta colors before. Nice story, that's, that's pretty cool for Nicholas Codner. So back to our feature yeah, matchup, T Canada 4-2 over New Brunswick. And how key, Russ, was that shot from Jimmy the Kid Gratton to make that draw to force Team Canada? Game saver, no question about it. And he, he, got, he got in at a good spot because he, he, he wanted it frozen, but it, it was on the corner, which made Botcher go that much wider, and they just misswept it a hair. And, and it was a guess. But it was looking like as many as four, and you force them to one. And now, you know, Gratton with a deuce here, it's, it's just all tied up. Oh! Oh! oh. Curl! 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 Oh, 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 oh. Okay. That's good. It's good. 
my end. What do you think? Or do we peel a corner? It's not so a good. Is it crazy to try to make the double peel off the left corner and the center one? Uh, yeah, that's risky though. If we yeah. we could tap we could them tap in too them by in. doing yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I don't mind that. Yeah, that's sure. Fine. Interesting. To not. Um, then, hey? They yeah. could peel two yeah. up. A couple feet more. Yeah. But they are sitting two, so at this yeah. point, if they play a really yeah. solid end, they're going to force Grat into a single. But they're, they're not going to choke off the corner guard. They're actually just going to go in the open. I, I'm a little bit surprised it's at there. that. It's there. No, never, never, never. Line's never. good. I think this is close card. Yeah. They don't want to. James has thrown that corner guard for a reason. Line's He'd good. like to get Line's around good. either of those Line's corners. Line. Line. Line's perfect. Clean. Line's good. Right on the T line. Line's good. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Doesn't need the curl. Don't want to get it too much behind yeah. that guard. That's the sorry, Jim. Good, good shot. Fun. Kathy, last time we checked in on Team Ontario, obviously a ton of frustration from the team, a pick from Glenn Howard. And Howard down by one, Dunstone Hammer in eight. Uh, but fighting their way back, scoring two last in, and Glenn made a great tap on his final. He is shot stone. Matt had a chance to lie two on his first, but was light, and that allowed that Ontario opportunity. Trying to tap his own now, chance for two, if he can get it on the angle. Dustin Kidby has been scrubbing the entire way. Oh, the little wick wick. Oh, man. And it will be a steal. So Glenn Howard, Team Ontario, battling back all tied up at six after eight. Great comeback after that disappointing pick. But uh, Dunstone almost got that by for a two. Boy, Paul. We can make up there. Good end, boys. Real good. Hindsight, we were just talking about right had the same line and bumped it another. Just bite right the four. Speed's nice. Yeah. 14, 14 7. Man, I thought. But Easy no, right now. No, we're good. Don't lose this one, guys. I thought that was a little Mine's quiet. Good. Okay. <laughs> Gotta go. Line's good. Go ahead. It's curling. Yep. Gotta go. Gotta go, Kark. Gotta go. Gotta go. Hard. Come on, Kark. Hard, Kark. Hard, Kark. Hard, Kark. You need to go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's a lot of effort. Karak Barton, all he had, and they're just shy of the paint. getting slower, to be honest. But. Uh, yeah. What, what do you think? think? Whatever you're still seeing. Get there. The yep. injured, injured not there based on this. And our first final on the Saturday night, handshakes between UConn and PEI as Tyler Smith takes the loss. And for Thomas Scoffin, out of the White Horse Curling Club, a 13-7 victory. And for Thomas, this is also a homecoming as well. He played a lot of curling in Alberta, Kathy. I believe a Canadian junior in this province for Alberta winning a silver medal. So... Nice for him to come back and compete here D in Lethbridge. Plus. And the biggest difference in that game was that the first round bye was given to Tyler Smith, and Thomas Scoffin had already been out on the ice, and it really was evident that he was okay. more comfortable, he being Scoffin, yeah. okay. and Tyler was chasing for much of the game. Ah, just a hair deep. Yeah, Saskatchewan Colton Flash with the bye tonight in this draw. Definitely more. Yeah, that's Just a good. pound Great slower good. here with the big crowd Great night line. game. Easy, easy. Most of the curlers are right-handed, and as this rock gets to the 12 foot, you're you're going over the wear pattern from the home end. Yep. Where everybody slides out right about hard. now, and it's where it can hard. just slow down that hard foot or so. Hard. Hard. And frozen to the lid, still shot stone, New Brunswick, but a great placement for Team Canada. Is it ever? See that yellow red up there too? That that's a that's a Team Canada rock that's coming back. If Roger chooses. Yeah. Okay. Little less. Pretty cool. Top four. No, it's, not, not, it's okay. Whoa. Line's good. Weight's close. Top Whoa. four. 
It's sliding pretty Mine's good. real good. Paul, oh, yep. It's gonna die here. It's gonna die. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Okay, well, it's over, Benny. Nice uh, throw. Not horrible. If they play something on it, we might catch them. Great was good. Great was perfect. Oh, just a lot. It looked like Max at the hog line. Did. Yeah, we've got kind of. I'm not really bullshit. Kind of. They're both tricky. That right way, now. he's always. That one's much harder. Yeah. This one, he could actually pick it in there. Yeah. I mean, his easiest shot right now is side button. Yeah. Hit that one. And our second official final as Cooey 14 3. We see Carter Rycroft back on the ice as the alternate getting some playing time. So 2 0 oh for Kevin Cooey, Team Alberta. <laughs> Yeah, that's something Kevin talked about as well. He always has a poker face, but he said on the inside, man, this feels good. He's very excited to have friends, family, people in the building once again at a briar. And good for John Morris. He said that you one like of the this? things about Carter being on the team is it's one of his best friends. Yeah. With, with the pandemic, they hadn't been able to spend time together. And when they got up, it was John who pointed at the bench to call Carter in. So even though he loves the excitement of this game, and he talks about maybe being his last, he sat back to allow Carter to play. I think that's awesome. And a half. I think Johnny Moe got the better of him at a Canadian Junior back in the day in the final as well, beating Carter Rycroft. A little room. Easy line. Close. Room. Wall okay. line. I didn't. Top. Lots of room. There by itself. Close. Line's Close, good. Close, but probably don't Dang want it. Skip Stones here in eight. Still room. Wait's good. Can't bounce. Wait's getting better, help, but. Can't bounce. Okay. Maybe just Take me, car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Easy, That's easy. Good. Good. That's a good spot. Drop. Ooh. Bounces out another inch as a red double. Pretty good, I think. Yeah. That's good. good yeah. Nice. Good judge. They're going a little bit farther on the front end. I would say they misjudged two or three by, you know, only a couple of feet, but it, it's just. I think oh, I know, that's I that much quicker than it has been the last couple of years because of the crowd, the heat from the crowd. Do we ever try and get rid of that somehow? Because then we would have the draw, right? Yeah. I might. He might. I can't. He might be shot after I try that, though. <laughs> or are you just talking about peeling it? Yeah. Do you want to know? Can we know is this? Is it doesn't doesn't do much for us? You might be able to kick this one out a little bit. I don't know if that helps. No. We need something on this side. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, exactly. no. We guys burned a whole lot of time yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. Um. Well, like you're right. He can't do much right now. He could maybe do. I don't think he can afford to do that. And then. That's not bad. Move it a foot. Guys, we have plenty of time, but do you guys want to time no, out? No, but what do you? Want to use the this? I can move it to the foot, and I can hammer that next time. But yeah, like it never touches this. Eh? I don't. I might give him a shot yeah. until I get shot. Though. I know. And it's yeah. Really bad. Right yeah. now we're scoring one. Yeah. yeah. It's not dead. And we can. We can. Work, try maybe to... if I peel that guard, I got a shot for two. Mm, don't think it's so. Tough. I don't even know if you can outdraw this here. Look. Well, I'll peel that guard, then I have. Yeah. This. That, yeah. that was the one that Actually, I was kind of thinking of. Kill it out on the end. What about? Do we do that even? If I ever knows it though, I'm not happy. Yeah. I like peeling this right now. That will give you but something. Peel, peel's not easy either. Eh? We're rattling something. Yeah, but that's okay. Like, we just can throw normal. Yeah, let's do that. Right? Yeah. Don't okay. juggle. It's an interesting situation here because here? there's a couple shots that Grat would like to play to set up his next one, but if they don't come off, like hitting that red one right where Darren's standing, if he hits it and rolls in, great. But if he hits it dead on. Botcher makes the double and he's sitting shot rock buried. Just even roll of the center line is not deadly. Just open K up the out turn draw. KG yep. play here, just trying to trying to leave some space for the out turn draw to the button, which is all I can see for two at this point. Deciding not to throw a bullet and so he doesn't disturb all the guards down yep. the center. Yeah. Clean. 
Yeah. Yeah. Clean. Whoa, 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 whoa. James Cratton is first here in eight. And where does that end up? He'll just push the red through. Doesn't hurt him. Good shot. Good shot. Player comparisons are brought to you by New Holland, proud sponsor of Curling Canada, and we focus on the skips. If, if we just threw one here, doesn't that do the and trick? As you see, he's developed a McGratton, as Gratton, obviously not the numbers he was looking for. Actually, if you look at the numbers, both skips, obviously not their best that we've seen percentage-wise for us, but what do you make of those numbers? Well, it, it, how do we get that the line? other six curlers have put enough pressure on the yeah. two skips when yeah. they have hammered yeah. to, to make yeah. some errors. Uh, James, oh, yeah. James had a zero by uh, trying to get a rock that was on the pin. He had to draw to it a little bit heavy. Uh, the one he came up light was probably the only no, no, real no, mistake, and I, I just think it was less rotation than anything. The guys didn't uh, see that curling into the slower area. Botcher's played really well. I was I, the only shot draw shot he's missed this week. Well, it's only two games. The only, he was 100% last night on draws, and he was 100% till last end when they actually overswept his tough shot for two. So, advantage Botcher for sure. What's he trying here? Might, might just be guarding with the other turn, Brian. You, you, you have to take so much ice in this arena ice, you're into a path that you're not, uh, the team's not used to, so. Just take the other turn. Line's good. Won the Heck Gervais Award last year as the MVP at the Briar and finally breaking through, winning his first tanker championship. Yep, go ahead. Yep, yep. Hard. We're good. We're good. That's good. Really smart play. Not even James Grant can make a curl to the button. I don't see anything. With you sweeping carving, though, Russ, there's well, a chance, Yeah, right? I hadn't but thought of that. Yeah. No. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, even Kathy liked that one. Okay. I could get in there, maybe top button to the T line. That's my best area. <laughs> that was all that was all right, left to throw it away for James Gratton. So he'll take his single. So back-to-back -back forces, Team Canada with Hammer as we'll step aside from Lethbridge. Welcome back to our Saturday night coverage of the Tim Hortons Briar here in Lethbridge. First time the city has hosted the National Men's Curling Championship. Aries here, Leon Botcher scored a single in the second, a couple steals in a row. It's been a good game back and forth. Beadstone's on the way. This one from Karik Martin as Team Canada trying to improve to 2 0 in their title defense. A 4 3 advantage. Up by one with Hammer here in nine, throwing the Red Stones. The last team to go back to back was Brad Gushu a few years back when they were able to defend. Get it in there. Good scrub, guys. Very good. Nice shot. It wasn't great. Yeah. There'll be some fur flying in this end with two guards by uh, New Brunswick. They've kind of played their hand already. They're all in. Watcher knows that. So two perfect shots by uh, Kark. Martin Kark's had two great games. Yeah, James is, yeah. I have to think it's just slowing down a bit 94 right now, not counting that rock, and 100 last night. I mean, he was, I mean, this whole team, but he was, that front end was brilliant in the bubble in oh, Calgary as well. Yes, 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 yes. I think we got to go with Todd. line. Line should be good. I, Top eight. Right. Yeah, top 12. Yeah. Come on. Line's Come on. good. Line's good. There go. Get her there, Darren. Come on. Yeah, line's fine. Come on, Darren. All you got. Let's go. Keep going. Go, 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 go. Just a little on the light side here, but get it in there. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. It's not getting any quicker. Definitely it isn't. In no, fact, sir. I was timing it, Russ, because you had mentioned something earlier, and the game started at about 15, 15-1, mm -hmm. and it's at 14-5 now, 14-4, sure. so it's definitely slowing down. Yeah, and it'll be maybe exaggerated in certain spots. If you get it wide enough, it'll probably still in that 15 area, but a little slow handle down that Please. slide path, they're, gonna, they're not going to be able to drag it. That's part of the problem. They can't Brad. drag it like they think they can. Now what? Is it a high one? 
Yeah. Make this good. Fourth prior appearance for Paul Dobson. It was Grattan's third in Kingston back in 2020. Okay. They had a three and four record anything. that year. Line, and he skipped New Brunswick in Hamilton up. way back in 2007. Wait's good. Got a curl. Got oh. a bend. It's getting better. Oh. Good spot, good spot. Sit. Good ball. So we know UConn beating PEI, Alberta beating Newfoundland, Labrador. Another game going on right next door, Ontario. And wild card number two, that's Matt Dunstone in a 6-6 tie. They blanked nine. So in 10, Dunstone all locked up with that critical hammer coming home. Well, and that's blank because Matt made an angle run double on his first to clear a lot of stones out. Glenn had to come back with a double of his own. So it was a blank, but some pretty great shot making to get to that point. Nice shot. Decent, nice job to clean some granite then we go here. from up front. Uh, double, whatever. What am I throwing? Firm. Okay. Good call. Instead of really risking it, which is what they kind of did by throwing up two guards, now the situation is a little different. They've got one in the oh, rings. Well, curl, Make curl. this fairly simple double. Stop the blank opportunity for Canada. That's the only thing New Brunswick can't have. Whoops. Roll it. Yeah, that's good. Okay. I like the throw. That's where uh, Botcher missed Y too. Remember the, they were just it's puzzled. All right. Anything just, stick around yeah, there. That felt good. That's Didn't that curl. same spot James threw earlier. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. I guess you put that in your book, right? You, yeah. You felt you threw it good. You communicate yep. that. Yeah, I miss, but. That's a spot you got to keep an eye on going forward. Line's good. Close. It looks good. Just for line. Yep. A little bit. Okay. Weight's good. Line's good. Weight's good. Easy. Easy. Weight's good. Whoa. Weight's good. Whoa, whoa. Wait, it's really, really good. good. Tee, top whoa, tee. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, never, whoa, never. Just a year. Whoa. 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 Super whoa. shot. Great shot. Yes. Pat. Very good. Yes. Good one. Yes. Got yes. Loser. Pat Jansen having a game. Yes. Around the yellow. Draw around the yellow. I don't want that. I was thinking shot, second shot around the yellow. Yeah. Well, I don't mind that. Cuts the rings down and who knows, right? Yep. Should be a little slower here. This is where being an ice maker and a great ice maker pays a dividends for all four New Brunswick players. This is going across the center, Whoa. which is, and when it gets to the hog line, that's the slide path at the far end where the wear and tear is. Darren, Darren immediately said it's slower here. Hard! Yep. Hard, you got it! Go, it's Andy! Not heavy. Go, Andy! Hard! McCann Dobson trying to answer yep. the call yep. Yep. again. Yep. And not as deep as they wanted, nor buried, but in the ring, stop 12. Isn't, isn't even the end of the I think world. we have to hit that one. Yeah. Don't mind a big roll either. Yeah. Try and get. Do you like board? Board. Board's the right yeah, I like that. call for it, this shot. Always pick the appropriate speed. Just, is it good? Just right in front, even. You're rolling to you hit. can freeze roll right ours, into it. You're good. Okay. Okay. I think try to freeze to ours. Yeah. yeah. Okay. If you throw a lot of weight board. and hit it thick board. enough to stay, it goes across the top of that corner red one by throwing board they can roll to sit three so the blank opportunities left town so 
Might as well try it for that two or three here. Two would be massive. Good boy. Oh, curl. <sighs> Gotta go, Brad. Gotta go. Gotta go. Hard. Hard. Hard, Brad! Right 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 Brad Thiessen, right right look right at the one. pounding trying to Watch curl it. There's the tap, there's the rollover, and another beauty. I can't tell you how many teams that I've watched play, maybe not at this level, or coached that would throw normal at that. It's kill the enemy rock. We're one up, we got a hammer. Let's get rid of that thing. Watch it. No, no. We throw the right weight, A. It gets Thiessen more effective because it's got more time to get down there. And it just wasn't going to roll very far. Perfect shot. Not rolling this one. And to add to that, you can use the world-class sweepers that you have. Right. Right. That right. he can finish it for you. And what a shot. Yeah, we want to roll right here. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So good normal, hey? I got Jeez. all of it. So you can throw any weight you want then. Well, I don't want to roll too far. I like I like just good normal. It's plugging, but we might be second over there. That goes right there. That's the other thing. Jansen rolled it perfect. I don't think James can get that uh, just, just that like top rock. This one here, I don't think he can get it out of play. So he's a, he can't hit this too thin either. He won't get the one that was just thrown. Too, so. we're, just, we're just rolling it to the top button. Okay. So he's trying to get the one that was just thrown by Pat and try to roll over to the center line and give uh, Botcher a tougher look. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, go. Skip Stones yeah. here in nine. James yeah. Grattan. The red piling up here against Team New Brunswick. Hit the Reds. Roll it over. Lovely shot from James Grattan. Top four. That's so good. Good shot. Couldn't have carried it down. Yeah. No, we probably didn't get it, did we? Ah. I think it's off. You think it's a, yeah. Oh, I thought it wasn't. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, who's closer on the sides there? We drive. Well, that's pretty good. <clears throat> Shooting, buddy. I think we're two. Yeah. It looks like we're two. Yeah. Maybe not if we're playing this. Oh, yeah, I don't know. Down. It's really important. So heavy hack. Are we second? Are we two? It's close. Okay. It's close. It sure looks red. I think red is Throw third shot stone here? right now. You do, eh? Okay. Just like a heavy hack. Okay. Just give me a little more. Yep. You're listening to a front end curler that has never measured a rock. <laughs> In you? And I, and I will continue to uh, rest just. Uh, uh, okay. I'm hoping she'll buy me breakfast in the morning. <laughs> we got a we got a morning draw to call, my friend. Almost yep. 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 Solid. Whoa. 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 Close. Whoa. 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 Solid hack. Clean. Brendan Blasher is first here in nine. Whoa. 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 Quiet wait and look at that. Nudges it back. How good is that? Tough double too. Good. Boy, it sure matters now who that mm, third exactly. is. Exactly. I think if James throws this hard enough, Kathy could jump across, yeah, make the double, and you're probably defense. buried her. I think so too. You can at least move that well, red that far enough. That yeah, you don't have to move it far, do you? We're hitting Under like two thirds, on. so maybe just center line. Yeah. I always think I got to go there, so I think it's time to take an inch last night. What about that last comment we just heard there, Russ? You just said, just moving the broom a little bit because of what he's seen in the game. Two things. Uh, they, 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 he's realized that this side's straighter, but it, it, on all these arena conditions at, at the top level, the ice gets straighter as the game goes along. So James has been in the briar so many times, he's got that figured out. That's not enough ice end number one, but it probably is now. Appearance number 15. At the big show, another appearance of the Tim Hortons Briar. Curl! Curl! Curl. All right, well, got it. All what has he got Andy. here? His final stone All and nine. Way. James Grattan. A big scrub. One. Roll it to the tap, and he is shot stone. Here in nine with one to come from Brendan Bosher. That's just about as good as he could do. He loved to kick that out of there, but. Boy, James. I'm. Uh, 
I don't think Brendan Botcher can see a ton of this yellow one. Throw, bud. Yeah, I suppose it doesn't matter. Really good shot. That spots. Look at that. It's 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 lost. It's buried. Makeable. And I thought we were gonna. Maybe they're playing the double. Yeah, uh, the double for three. So. Oh, okay, sorry, I didn't hear. I suppose he has the same shot. Whether I get that out or not. This is wide. He can't miss narrow. You're tight coming home if he doesn't make this. He can make it off his own actually if he flashes it. That's true, eh? Bro! Final stone and nine. Bro! Brendan Botcher. <laughs> to take a stranglehold in the game. Yellow actually hits his red. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> Hear the crowd's reaction, a steal. New Brunswick still alive, all tied up at four. <laughs> 39 year old Andy McCann Lead stones for Team New Brunswick, and what a steal by James Gratton in nine. So here in 10 in a 4-4 tie. It is Team Canada Red Stones with Hammer. But that gives certainly this team a little bit of life as we come home in 10, Russ. And as we saw last night, anything can happen in these close games. We just watched anything could happen. I didn't see that happening at all. I thought he'd make contact on the top one. I'm not sure how he'd miss the Gratton's back one for at least a score of a single. Really, really great fight for Team uh, Gratton here. They, I talked in the opening about, yes, you've got Darren Molding and James Gratton's a proven veteran and a great player, but good to front end hang in there. Andy McCann, 96%. Paul Dobson, 90. Out curling Team Canada's front end. Easy. Line's good. Easy. Line's good. Line's good. Hair light. Yep, 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 yep. Go, yep. guys. Go. 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 Go
Okay. Good shot. Good shot, Brad. Okay. Yeah, it didn't curl enough. Another good inch, and that, that's made. Brad turning oh, 32 back on more. March the 1st. Hair thicker. Yeah. Good throw. Yeah. It's the hair thicker. Not bad. Good. You want to keep as a, as a maybe a fifth man or a coach keep track of the errors, the misses, and, the, and the, you'll, a lot of cases there's a theme. Everything's yeah, being missed wide here now. It, tight. Probably Whoa. because it's just getting a little straighter. Real tight. They yeah. did that for us. There's not a big enough book though. <laughs> <laughs> there's a pattern, all right. No made shots. Yeah. Jeez, that spot. Top nowhere, 12. Nowhere near, like, oh. Nowhere. What is it about that spot? It's just sped up. Everybody's gone. Yeah. Must have been, yeah. Shit. Okay, but Come that on. can happen, believe it or not. The ice should slow down, especially down the middle. I've been talking about it all game, like but they're down to one man. sheet. Gets a little cooler. Sorry, man. Cross me. Huge shot here. Whoa! Girl! Whoa! 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 Girl! Whoa! Oh. Precision. Beautiful shot making. Let's go, Darren. Time now for the game story brought to you by Tim Hortons, the official coffee of Curling Canada. And in a 4 4 tie, it's been an entertaining game, a close game. But what's been the difference thus far in your mind, Ryan? Well, the 3 0 lead, I think. And it really was James had a really tough shot. He had to draw the pin a little bit heavy. That made it 3 0. It's tough to catch a team like Team Canada from that. But look at that 83 New Brunswick, 82 Team Canada. They might be 0 2 here, but a wonderful start for New Brunswick. Just makes me think, too, back to the Scotties and Andrea Crawford. What a special yeah. run that was. And actually, you know, James talked about her and that team, how proud he was, how happy he was for that team. How many years have they been knocking on the door and just a wonderful yeah, performance exactly. that he runs with? No, no kidding. Andrea is, Andrea is just one of the best shot makers that nobody seems to know about. And it's all about, again, just like Grattan, you got to find four players. James Grattan's four players have really supported him tonight, and they're taking on last year's best team in the country right down to the last brick. Clean! Close. Pack. Oh. It really sends a nice Don't message because you sometimes the we East goes on. Oh, we yeah. can't beat these guys, and yes, you can. Not all the time. Well, you saw that note on the screen. Close game as well in the bubble. Six five. Yes. That's fine. Didn't want to leave it there, Brian. Wanted to roll right out in the open. Yeah. And Botcher too, so battle tested. Think about it. We talked about yeah. the Briar Finals, his yeah, first one in St. Yeah. John's. They got Saint beat up a little bit, time. three mm -hmm. wins. Kind of He's been back ever there. since. Oh, Consecutive okay. Briar appearances. Defending champ, Maple Leaf on your back, yeah. and I, I mean, he's played in a lot of these games. No. He's been on both sides. It's got to make you better. Nice. It has to. It just does. The little things you learn in all these pressure situations. I knew it was heavy right at okay. the well, then Okay. Yeah. So from four sheets yep. in play yep. down to this nice. one whoa, in our whoa, feature. Whoa, line. Whoa, line. Whoa. Yep. Wait's good. Yo! Wow. Oh, wait on me. Run in a bit. Line's there. good. Yes. Wait there. Wait there. Straight. Wait there. there. A little bounce. Whoa. Pumping. Pretty heavy. Curl. Whoa. No, you can't. Curl. Curl. He needs to curl up a little tap. It is shot stone. Found the line for the next one. Hopefully, hopefully yeah. he just picks it. That was really interesting. That was 1428. So if you throw that in the first couple of ends, you're back 12 or mm -hmm, through the house. Mm -hmm. And they were still calling heavy, but also when it's got to that slide path, right. it got slower and it started to break. Yeah. But for James, if he's in that same path, I think he'll know. But boy, if you get outside of that, it can make you look foolish. It, it, it's so true. It's hard to explain that to people because you'll, you'll go home and people say, well, that guy couldn't even draw the eight foot. Well, you know, you, it's it's not identical across the no. sheet for the whole three hours. Please. Dead yeah. on might be Whoa. the play here, Kathy. Hey, yeah. yeah. Brendan Botcher, his Hi. first and 10. Hi. And a 4-4 tie by the guard. Bang the yellow, voids the jam. 
And he'll sit two, but is there a little pocket now to try come to? Certainly is. I, I, I'm not sure. I thought, I assumed they were trying to roll the other way. I think so too, because you're giving him the same shot and now wow. you're forcing Brendan. We've just talked about the draw weight to draw full four. Sorry. And that can Pardon? be tricky. Sorry. And Brendan oh, can't okay. pick it across I was the yelling away. high side either to, uh, it's gonna jam. So that if this is made, it's, he's got button and that's all. Lock it on, Paul. Okay. He'll be close. You heard his last yep, comment. Last Hopefully, line. I get another hard, chance hard, to know the path. Yep, Needs to be shot Blade's stone. Good. His final go. stone here in 10. Wait, heavy, baby. Wait, Easy, easy. It's running. Molding the whoa, call. Whoa, 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 it's going to slow down. No. They didn't want to overbrush this. Has to be shot stone. Ah. Needs to dig in a little tap. But very much available here for Brendan Botcher with one to come. Just a little enthusiasm early on the brushing. You know, they were waiting for it to hit the slide path. Weight was, was decent, yeah. just, you know what I mean? Those are tough. Like a, the uh, perfect freeze is as hard as it gets, and you're going across that center line. Exactly what Botcher was hoping for. And the bonus here, you don't have to worry about the shooter. You got the red counters. Just make the yellow go away. Oh, clean, clean, clean. Final stone. Clean. Brendan Botcher clean. on the clean. way. Clean. Brushes down. Clean. Yellow goes, and Brendan Botcher, Team Canada, a massive win as he improves to 2-0. and oh. And disappointing for Darren Molding in his hometown and a new team. Give him credit, they battled. But the defending champs, it's early but perfect as they'll celebrate a 6-4 win. Brendan Botcher out of Edmonton improving to 2-0. And, oh. and two close games to start for James Gratton out of Oromocto. Thanks everyone. Thank you. Yeah, pretty nice, even in a loss for Darren Molding. Boss. As we check the standings, so Pool A, Cooey, Dunstone, Botcher, 2 0. McEwen, Fleming, Jacobs, Gushu winning their openers. Top three from each pool advance to the playoffs. And you want to be top in your pool, guarantees you more life when it comes to the championship round, which is next weekend. Yeah, always nice to be home. Photos with fans, even in a loss. Always great to catch up with the fans in the building. We'll step aside and wrap things up next. Thanks, guys. The Tim Hortons Briar is brought to you by Tim Hortons, the official coffee of Curling Canada. By New Holland, proud sponsor of Curling Canada. By BKT Tires and OK Tire. And by Home Hardware. Here's how. Yeah, win or lose, always nice to have a hug from your buddy, his son Brady. A tough one for New Brunswick as Darren Molding back. Basically his second home of Lethbridge. Tomorrow morning, draw four, we are back. Myself, Kathy Gauthier will have the call. Mike McHugh in Manitoba at 1-0, taking on one of the wildcard teams. Jason Gunlickson out of Manitoba when we return tomorrow, 10.30 a.m. Eastern time, draw four, Pool B, right here on TSN. Yeah, a rematch of former friends, teammates, as Team Canada, Brendan Botcher in his own province, improving to 2-0 and on behalf of myself, Russ Howard, Kathy Goche, thanks for watching our coverage. We'll return tomorrow right here on TSN. In the meantime, SportsCenter is next with Jermaine Franklin and Mark Rowe.